Chapter 21 If you can't guide me, then I will test you. After listening to Yang Chen's words, Shang Yuan Feng felt as if he had gained enlightenment. Several years of doubt had apparently dispersed. For many years he had listened to the experiences of many experts at the foundation stage, and all of them had said that the final juncture was the most difficult. Most of them had to use every method available to be able to break through. Shang Yuan Feng had been incessantly pondering for a way to break through, using the experience of his predecessors as basis, but he hadn't been able to succeed. His efforts had always fallen short at the final moment. But that also increasingly affirmed his conclusion that for the last extremely difficult juncture on building his foundation, he would need to retain a portion of his strength for the last big effort. At the very least several foundation stage experts had said that this was the correct strategy. But, the experiences of others may not be entirely suited for every person, so Shang Yuan Feng had continuously tried for several years, in the end, exhausting both his body and mind. Ten years of disappointment had made him lose all hope, and at last he became completely discouraged and without any hope to reach the foundation stage. From then on, he had diligently taken care of Pure Yang Palace's Yishu Manor until today. According to Yang Chen's memories of him in his previous life, Shang Yuan Feng had finally broken through and reached foundation stage, precisely by using his full strength, without holding back, to pound against the juncture. At that time he had still regretted that, if he had used this kind of method a hundred years ago, maybe he would have entered foundation stage and become an inner disciple much earlier, and would not have wasted two hundred years of missing the most optimal cultivation period. In this life, since Shang Yuan Feng had already shown this kind of attitude, Yang Chen did not mind telling him about this information. In any case, making a favorable impression on a foundation stage manager in the Yishu Manor was not a bad thing for him. Furthermore, doing this kind of huge favor, which had cost him nothing, there was no reason not to do it. However Shang Yuan Feng did not feel like this. Originally he had lost all hope, but now suddenly that flaming desire was once again ignited within his heart. Thinking about Yang Chen's method, he had already dreamed of himself reaching foundation stage. After pondering for a moment, he suddenly got up and deeply thanked Yang Chen. Many thanks, younger brother Yang, for giving me directions, if I succeed in building my foundation in the future, I will never forget younger brother Yang's kindness for guiding me. Even though he only said these words, in his heart, Shang Yuan Feng felt an unspeakable gratitude towards Yang Chen. Building foundation. Yang Chen pretended to blank out for a moment and then smilingly said. Senior brother Shang Yuan, we were only discussing about some martial techniques we have experienced, this had no relation with building a foundation. If senior brother had an insight, that is only because of senior brother's good fortune, it cannot be attributed to me. Though Yang Chen had said this, Shang Yuan Feng didn't think like that. The more Yang Chen didn't claim credit for himself, the more pure and good his nature seemed, the more Shang Yuan Feng felt grateful in his heart. Feeling delighted, Shang Yuan Feng didn't care about anyone else, and once again cupped his hands towards Yang Chen to show his thanks. Younger brother Yang, I will immediately go and train in seclusion for one to three months, and as soon as I come out, I will personally give directions to you. Other people may not dare to teach a third Kai layer disciple, but in any case this old man is still qualified, right? Then I wish for elder brother to succeed. Yang Chen also did not forget about complimenting Shang Yuan Feng, and soon afterwards he continued speaking. Many thanks elder brother Shang Yuan. Unconsciously he had already started calling him as elder brother and not manager. This time, Shang Yuan Feng's actions had become even more rapid. In the evening of the same day, all four servants who injured by Yang Chen were delivered to the profound pavilion. The injuries on their bodies had almost recovered, external injuries already couldn't be seen anymore. It could be assumed that a lot of precious medicines were used for their treatment. And that night, Shang Yuan Feng arranged everything and hurriedly started his closed-door training to build his foundation. When Shen Da and other three saw Yang Chen again they were not as unruly as before. These four were mere servants, but after the cold reception given to Yang Chen in the morning, when they had these kinds of malicious thoughts, having experienced Yang Chen's invincible might, where all of them had been beaten unconscious and on top of that, with Shang Yuan Feng's repeated warnings. These four did not dare to have any more ill-conceived thoughts. When confronting Yang Chen, all of them bowed respectfully, and when Yang Chen asked them to do something, none of them dared to disobey. While Shang Yuan Feng had entered closed-door training, Yang Chen had no choice but to face Chu Heng's malicious moves again. He had made Yang Chen's position so high that everyone who met him had to cup his hands and treat him respectfully so that Yang Chen could not complain about anything. Although Yang Chen did not care about learning any fundamental knowledge, as he wouldn't need it in order to not arouse any suspicion, he could not help but put up appearances as if he was learning from the beginning. 
otherwise, if a person who was filled with political wisdom could practice pharmacy and could distinguish different medicines proficiently, having near-perfect knowledge of geography of stars was nothing but an executioner, it would definitely arouse suspicions. Immortal cultivation sects placed extreme importance on teaching the future generations, if Yang Chen were to expose all this knowledge, then he would surely be considered as a spy from another sect, sent to steal Pure Yang Palace's teachings. In that case, it could be said that Chu Hang would surely rejoice for getting rid of Yang Chen, while at the same time rendering a great service for the sect. Therefore, Yang Chen had to pretend and assume the appearance of an individual learning from the beginning. Naturally, Yang Chen's background as an executioner had already established him as an illiterate person, with no knowledge about most letters. Well, of course he would recognize some letters, but in no way would they exceed a hundred. Shang Yuan Feng had said that after coming out of seclusion, he would personally teach Yang Chen. But in Yang Chen's eyes, this affair arranged by Shang Yuan Feng was merely a case of using an extraordinary person in an insignificant position. Using this simple affair in exchange for Yang Chen's huge favor, it really was too cheap. Next morning, with Shen Da leading the way, Yang Chen once again went to the book pavilion, where the preparatory disciples studied. But this time he did not go directly to the pavilion of the preparatory disciples who had joined with him, but rather he came to the pavilion where the disciples who had joined one year earlier than him were studying. Seeing Yang Chen, the old teacher in the pavilion stopped and cupped his hands towards him. Senior brother Yang, it is a great honor for us that you have come to this Hanlin pavilion, I suppose this is to give directions to these younger brothers. I invite you to the seat of honor. And gave the same excuse as yesterday. Those sitting disciples also all stood up and showed their regards, everything was the same as yesterday without any difference. I don't dare, this Yang is just a newcomer who still doesn't understand many things. For some things I would like master to provide some guidance. Yang Chen reasoned curtly with a humble attitude. Uh, I do not dare, do not dare. Who would dare to teach senior brother Yang? The old teacher replied with great alarm in an exaggerated manner of speaking, while he continuously moved both hands, saying. I'm not qualified. Are you not able to guide me? Seeing this kind of careless manner, Yang Chen's tone immediately changed. Absolutely do not dare. Senior brother Yang. The old teacher still continued with this kind of manner. Yang Chen or a third Kai layer disciple, how can we dare to teach Yang Chen? Absolutely not. Humph. Yang Chen coldly snorted. Since this is the case, I also will not make things difficult for you. Only I fear that you are lazy and incompetent and will hamper the student's progress, so first I will test you. Bang. The book was thrown in front of the old teacher, and Yang Chen pointed a large golden sword at the seat. Slashing it deeply he said. Read every letter of every sentence from this book aloud and then explain it to me, I will listen and check whether you have made a mistake or not. After Yang Chen said this, no matter whether it was the old teacher or the preparatory disciples, all of them were the same as Shen Da and foolishly stared at Yang Chen. Test HM. What is this? Only, no matter who it was, no one dared to disagree. Yang Chen had been given the status of a third Kai layer disciple, this had been decided and passed down by the accomplished disciple Chu Hang, and at the same time properly arranged by manager Shang Yun. Who would dare to dishonor him? Since he was a third Kai layer outer disciple, naturally he had the authority to inspect and test other preparatory disciples, and even had the authority to inspect these teachers. But, if this happened, were Uncle Master Chu's arrangements still useful? The first one to respond was actually Shen Da. Ever since Yang Chen had ruthlessly taught him a lesson he did not dare to have any other thoughts in his mind, adding to that Shang Yuan Feng's repeated warnings, Shen Da already understood the circumstances. Of course, the most important point of all of this was that this action of Yang Chen didn't break Uncle Master Chu's established rules at all and was completely fair and reasonable, so even if he was here, he would also be unable to say anything. Hence, Shen Da shouted loudly towards the teacher. Young Master Yang has commanded something, are you still not complying? Shen Da was someone among servants who had prestige, that old teacher didn't dare to neglect this shout and hastily picked up the book thrown by Yang Chen and started reading loudly. Since he had already became aware that Chu Hang's arrangements had no meaning now, the old teacher also meaningfully glanced at him and not only started reading slowly and loudly, but also explained very clearly and logically, showing no signs of attempting to use crafty tricks. The other preparatory disciples looked at Yang Chen, it seemed that they had also changed a little bit. Since Yang Chen could use this kind of method to break his obstructions and in addition to that could also enjoy a higher status when compared to others, including experience many natural resources, maybe he would very quickly rise above everyone. However no one could say anything, so all of them were calmly listening to the old teacher reading the book, acting as if they were not able to understand it very well the first time. 
Yang Chen held a book in his hand, it was the same as the book in the old teacher's hand, and he was pretending to turn the pages and read, but in the eyes of other people, it seemed as if he trying to remember something, and they actually did not dare to interrupt him. Yesterday, Yang Chen had fought with four third Kai layer servants alone, three of whom had cultivation tools, and one of them furthermore cultivated blazing palms. All of them were beaten by Yang Chen. This news has already spread, so naturally no one dared to disregard him. From next day, every day Yang Chen would just change the teacher and the book. Every time a teacher would be forced to read a book for him and explain it, using the pompous reason of testing them to check whether they were competent or not. In every case the individual whom he demanded to test had to read books for a day or half a day, and eventually all of them were made to read and explain one or two books before giving up. Very quickly every teacher became used to this kind of thing. Firstly, Yang Chen hadn't broken any rules, and secondly, before entering seclusion, Shang Yun Feng had taken care of this and had specifically instructed all teachers to help out Yang Chen as much as they could. So they had done as much as possible in accordance to Yang Chen's request, without creating much problems. At the same, while Yang Chen was sending off the teachers for medicine debation, Du Qian appeared in the profound pavilion. After sending them off, Yang Chen turned around just to discover Du Qian looking at him with an expression that was a smile, yet not a smile. Uncle Master Du. Yang Chen hastily greeted him according to proper ceremony, it was a rule that ceremonies could not be disregarded. Originally I had thought that Chu Hang would give specific directions to make things difficult for you, but now it seems you are doing alright. Liu Qian was very appreciative of Yang Chen, perhaps it was because Yang Chen's background as an executioner and his own status as a disciple of the law enforcement hall were very similar. Furthermore at that time, Yang Chen had completely destroyed Chu Hang's reputation, so until now Du Qian had believed that Yang Chen's life was not very satisfactory, but after coming here that belief had completely changed. Du Qian then asked. Has Yu Feng revoked your status? My status is still the same. Yang Chen replied with a somewhat self-deprecating smile. Then why did that teacher dare to to teach medicine to you? Du Qian did not understand, he originally thought to help Yang Chen, but it seemed as if Yang Chen no longer required it. Teach medicine to this disciple. No, no, no. Uncle Master Du, you are mistaken. Yang Chen seriously shook his finger while continuing. He wasn't teaching medicine to me, Uncle Master Du. I have seen it with my own eyes, how can it be wrong? Du Qian laughingly scolded him, but soon after that he asked. He didn't teach you to debate about medicine, then what? Were you teaching him? More or less, Uncle Master Du. He. Yang Chen laughed. He was not teaching this disciple, this disciple was inspecting him, watching whether he is knowledgeable of his topics, so that fellow brothers are not misguided. You are also aware that, since disciple has a higher status than his fellow disciples, naturally this disciple was asked to take responsibility to check and inspect. I reluctantly had to accept this affair. But I will seriously test them, so as to avoid some people from cheating others for their personal gains and neglect the future of many fellow brothers. Hearing Yang Chen speak these kinds of shameless words proudly, Du Qian, whose nature was quite honest, could not help but smile. Shaking his head, he disappeared. Even though it was out of question for Du Qian to provide much help to Yang Chen, there would always be a feeling of familiarity. Although this visit by Du Qian did not serve any purpose, seeing Yang Chen getting the same opportunities as the other disciples made him feel quite relieved. Since there was not much of a problem, he also didn't tangle much and turned around to leave. Yang Chen was learning very rapidly, at least in the eyes of others this was so. No matter which book it was, as long as it had been read and explained once, he would immediately remember it. In a brief period of two months, all of the introductory books on learning characters, learning pharmacy, distinguishing medicine and learning the geography of stars, which the preparatory disciples had to learn in three years, were already studied by him. All the other preparatory disciples, who had entered with Yang Chen, were slowly learning to read and write characters, Yang Chen already stood at the gate of the achievement room at the core of the Yishu Manor. Here, two outer disciples were stationed at all times to guard the starting cultivation techniques for those who entered the sect, but it was highly unlikely that it held any other cultivation techniques. To experience the cultivation of high-level techniques, he would first have to become an official outer disciple, only then could he go to learn from a successful outer disciple personally. This one is called Yang Chen, I have come today to enter the cultivation room to find a suitable method to cultivate, I ask for these elder brothers to help me out. Yang Chen said with about the outer disciples who were guarding the cultivation room. Yang Chen. I know you, you have just entered the Yishu Manor some days ago. Just after these couple of days you want cultivation techniques. You think too poorly of my Pure Yang Palace. 
the relationship between the disciple who was guarding the cultivation room and Sun Hai Jing was pretty good, so he had already heard about Yang Chen beating Sun Hai Jing and was thus deliberately trying to make things difficult for Yang Chen. Do you really believe that you have already become a third Kai Layer disciple? Yang Chen still hadn't replied when suddenly within the Yishu Manor, there was a burst of heavenly energy, powerfully rising in an imposing manner. Soon afterwards, it suddenly withdrew, following which a strong spiritual awareness swept through the place, affecting anyone who came in contact with it. Which uncle master has succeeded in building a foundation? Seeing the circumstances, that one outer disciple asked, being very surprised, but Yang Chen clearly understood who it was. If you are enjoying the content let a like, comment and subscribe to Fantasy World for more. Chapter 22 Yin 5 Phases Complete the Shu Manor was the most outer layer of the Pure Yang Palace, and it was also the region where all of the new disciples with spirit roots began to build their foundations. Some distance apart from there, the outer disciples resided in the Nine Earth Manor. But suddenly someone had succeeded in building their foundation here, this was simply impossible in the eyes of those outer disciples. Someone who had such a cultivation had still not become an outer disciple. Despite being pleasantly surprised, the outer disciple stationed at the gate did not dare to be certain. If he had not already experienced the eruption of the heavenly strength at an earlier time when another senior had succeeded in building his foundation, he would have not dared to determine that this was someone who had successfully reached the foundation stage. In a flash, at the summit of the Yishu Manor, the silhouette of a person appeared. The silhouette seemed to be confirming the direction and then directly flew towards Yang Chen's side. Before the person himself had appeared, his voice had already reached Yang Chen's and the guarding outer disciple's ears. Ha 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 ha, my brother Yang, if it were not for you guiding me, I still would not have dared to accept that I will see this day. Chang Yuan Feng had just come out of seclusion and immediately searched for Yang Chen's location and hurriedly flew to here. He had already succeeded in building his foundation, so flying was nothing difficult for him, and after reaching the foundation stage, the first person he wanted to meet was precisely Yang Chen. Although he had met Yang Chen only two times, Chang Yuan Feng had sensed an incredible affinity with Yang Chen. If he had followed Chu Heng's instructions and had secretly suppressed Yang Chen, then he would not have this feeling right now. Because of Yang Chen he was already a foundation stage expert and an inner disciple, he now had the means to resist Chu Heng. He wanted to assist Yang Chen in his matters, but when all was said and done, the things Chu Heng had done were best kept under the table, so as to not affect Sek's reputation. Seeing Shang Yuan Feng appear, the guarding outer disciple's mouth opened widely, he wanted to say something, but ultimately he wasn't able to speak out. Who could have anticipated that the one who had succeeded in building his foundation was Shang Yuan Feng, the manager of Yishu Manor, who had been deemed as too hopeless to reach the foundation stage. Greetings, Uncle Master Shang Yuan. The guarding disciple ultimately used Uncle Master to address him, only he did not seem as delighted as Yang Chen. Then. Shang Yuan Feng faintly responded, but did not pay any more attention to the guarding disciple afterwards, and turned to Yang Chen, asking. Brother Yang, what do you want from here? Elder brother Shang Yuan. Yang Chen didn't address him as uncle master according to the seniority, but rather took the opportunity when Shang Yuan Feng had affectionately called him as brother to address him as elder brother and said. I have come here to look for a cultivation method of the sect that is suitable for me. Then go in and choose. Shang Yuan Feng waved his large hand and without raising any objections, allowed him to pass. He was still the manager of Yishu Manor and hadn't left his post yet, also, as he had successfully reached the foundation stage, his influence had greatly increased. The guarding disciple who was continuously expressing his opposition didn't even dare to speak a word in front of him and obediently got out of the way. For selecting a cultivation method I will not go in with you, as I could easily misguide you. Before Yang Chen had set out to go into the room, Shang Yuan Feng repeatedly warned him. Remember, you have a fire spirit root, so select a fire attributed cultivation method. Many thanks for your guidance, elder brother. Yang Chen cupped his hands towards Shang Yuan Feng to express his thanks. Although he didn't guide him inside, despite owing Yang Chen a huge favor, these words of Shang Yuan Feng were all very precious, and they showed his support and concern for Yang Chen. Even if he hadn't said anything, Yang Chen naturally understood already knew what he should or should not do. Watching Yang Chen enter the achievements room, the guarding disciple almost opened his mouth to say something, but ultimately chose to shut up in front of Shang Yuan Feng. Anyway, Shang Yuan Feng had already reached the foundation stage, so in few days he would have to leave. By the time the newly appointed manager arrived, Yang Chen would still have no one to guide him regarding the matters of cultivation, and he was also not someone who could read some random foundation books by himself, quickly understand their points and succeed easily. Especially for those who had just entered the sect, they needed to stay at the Yishu Manor for at least three years, so when the time came, Yang Chen would understand everything. 
Although the Pure Yang Palace was a small sect, it still had the complete yin and yang, five phases cultivation method. Since all of these cultivation methods were prepared for preparatory disciples, all of them were copied in a book rather than a jade slip. Preparatory disciples still hadn't learned to cultivate and produce spiritual awareness, so even if the cultivation techniques were on a jade slip, these preparatory disciples would be unable to read them. Yang Chen vaguely remembered the layout of the achievements room, after coming in, he remembered everything completely with just one glance around. Without any hesitation he directly went to the area where fire attributed cultivation methods were kept and selected the fourth book from the region, naturally just for the sake of keeping up appearances. In his previous life he knew the fire attributed cultivation methods well, so in this life, he had no need to select fire attributed cultivation methods again. Soon after that, Yang Chen resolutely moved towards the region having the earth attributed cultivation methods. To go from one region to another in the achievement room, one had to pass through a magical array, and the people outside would absolutely not be aware of the cultivation method chosen by the person. They were not even aware of anything that the candidate did inside, which was quite convenient for Yang Chen. Cultivators would generally allow their fate to choose, they generally chose any cultivation method just to give it a try, or one they had received beforehand. This was especially the case for those who had just entered the sect as preparatory disciples. Under normal conditions it was very rare that someone insisted on choosing a particular method. Even if it was the younger generation who had been cultivating in the sect since their childhood, they were also like this. Only after reaching the foundation stage would they choose a better cultivation practice. This was also why the room was without any supervision. Yang Chen found his Yin Five Phases cultivation method with ease. Finally he turned towards the metal attributed region to similarly find a book for metal attributed cultivation method. Yang Chen didn't bring these other two cultivation method books out of the room, but rather memorized them inside. Due to his spiritual awareness and being reincarnated, Yang Chen possessed a highly retentive memory. In just a short moment he remembered all of the key secrets of the two cultivation methods. In his previous life, apart from fire attributed cultivation methods, Yang Chen did not care about the other attributes. Although his brain had some impression of the other cultivation methods, it was only because after his reincarnation, when he received these cultivation methods from the immortals he executed. He had used his spiritual awareness to memorize them, but he had never used them before. Naturally in his past life he would not go around and deliberately collect an entire set of yin and yang five phases cultivation method, as he was not a sect leader, so he didn't have to worry about it. But now Yang Chen had all of the starting portions for the yin and yang five phases cultivation secrets. Next he would have to cultivate the yin five phases cultivation methods together with the yang five phases cultivation methods at the same time so that they would be able to restrain each other and reach a perfect balance. Of course, this was Yang Chen's final target. Yang Chen's currently goal was to circulate 10 cultivation methods of yin and yang so that they would be able to restrain each other simultaneously and have not just the five phases but also yin and yang attain a perfect equilibrium, only then would he be able to achieve his goal. Until then, perhaps Yang Chen would reach the boundary of the first Kai layer. However now that he had already gotten the cultivation method, he could openly begin his cultivation. This was a huge step towards accomplishing his dream to pay his respects under his master again. Maybe, very soon Yang Chen would be able to see his master's beautiful face and become her disciple again. Everything Yang Chen was doing at the moment was just to pay his respects and study under his master again. As for his personal enemies, he had ignored them for the time being. Even if he wanted to go after them, he was only a minor Kai layer disciple who had just joined a sect, how could he single-handedly kill disciples of the greatest sky sect? Only an idiot would come up with such a moronic idea. Seeing Yang Chen come out with a fire attributed cultivation method, Shang Yun Feng didn't say anything. It was just an introductory cultivation method, nothing more, and it didn't have any great merit or demerit. It would only allow the new disciple to feel Kai and circulate it, become aware of the spiritual influence of heaven and earth, and also connect with it and at the same time produce the necessary spiritual awareness. These cultivation methods were different only in the name the big cultivation sects chose for them. No matter which one Yang Chen chose, all were the same. As long as it was fire attributed, it would do. When Yang Chen was choosing a cultivation method, Shang Yun Feng stood like a guard at the entrance of the achievement room, calmly waiting for him. His conversation with Yang Chen, using elder brother and brother to address each other, in addition to Shang Yun Feng's straightforward manner, already explained many things. Even if the guarding disciple still wanted to play some tricks, he could not find any means to do so, and could only wait calmly with Shang Yun Feng for Yang Chen to come out. Let's go to the profound pavilion, I will explain this cultivation method once for your benefit. Shang Yun Feng snatched and took hold of the cultivation method. After browsing through it once, he understood it clearly. 
Hardly waiting for Yang Chen to express his views, he directly turned around and disappeared with Yang Chen from the achievement room's entrance. The disciple guarding the achievement room did not dare to neglect this and immediately told the other disciple to go and notify the Nine Earth Manor. Having Shang Yu and Feng's support, if Xu Hang still wanted to stop Yang Chen, it would just be a joke. Brother Yang, since you don't have spiritual awareness, you can just listen to my explanation. Shang Yu and Feng began to read that book of the fire attributed cultivation method for Yang Chen to study it once. Soon after that, he also began to explain every word in every sentence. Although Yang Chen had learned this cultivation method long ago and he could even recite it by heart, at this moment he still had no choice but to assume a sincere appearance and listen. Shang Yu and Feng became very delighted, he was well aware that on the path of cultivation, apart from the natural talent, the most important thing was one's own perception and hard work. A person with a spirit root of great value could naturally cultivate easily and become an expert. The comprehension of different cultivation method as well realizing the boundary of every realm was different for every person. Many individuals who had a spirit root were eliminated only because of this reason. This three-year period was to test the aptitude of every large sex preparatory disciples. If one's perception was not good, then his hard work would be in vain. Yang Chen understood Shang Yu and Feng's intention clearly, plus he also needed this kind of justification to cover up his abnormal cultivation speed. Therefore, going along with Shang Yu and Feng's idea, he stayed within the profound pavilion for several days. Next, after Yang Chen clearly understood the cultivation method secrets with the help of Shang Yu and Feng's initiation, he started the so-called first-time cultivation. Naturally that was only a facade to show Shang Yu and Feng, underneath he started to cultivate the three purity secrets and was learning to use the second cultivation secret for a week. Only after the week was over did he open his eyes to stop cultivating. Nearly no one had been able to succeed the first time they cultivate, naturally Yang Chen was also not an exception. As soon as Yang Chen appeared from the quiet room in the profound pavilion after the cultivation period was over, Shang Yu and Feng walked towards him, even leaving his own training he had hurriedly come to ask with his face full of expectation. How do you feel? I can dimly sense a trace of Kai in the air. Yang Chen had previous experience about it, so naturally he was aware of what capacity would make Shang Yu and Feng happy, while not arousing his suspicion at the same time. Not bad, not bad, you can feel the Kai in just one try, even if it was someone with better innate talent, he could still not have done better. Shang Yu and Feng seemed exceptionally happy. It seems my last few days effort haven't gone to waste. Many thanks elder brother. Yang Chen laughingly expressed his thanks. Afterwards he quickly moved towards Shang Yu and Feng and asked. Elder brother, when do you intend to depart from Yishu Manor? Shang Yuan did not hide anything and directly told Yang Chen everything. Since I have already succeeded in building my foundation, I had already informed the seniors about this a few days ago, and they have already urged me many times to come and pay my respects and enter the inner courtyard, but I have intentionally delayed it many times, so as to give directions to you. Now that you can comprehend it by yourself, it is also the time for me to go, finally. Yang Chen had already anticipated these kind of circumstances. Shang Yu and Feng had reached the foundation stage, so naturally he would become an inner disciple, and Yi Xu Manor would surely get a new manager. Fortunately, Shang Yu and Feng had visited here before leaving, this actually saved a lot of trouble for Yang Chen. Afterwards even if Yang Chen's cultivation was a little bit extraordinary, it could all be attributed to Shang Yu and Feng's previous guidance. After I go, brother you also need not be afraid and endure silently that Chu Hang is an inner disciple, now I am also one. Furthermore, a few days ago, senior brother Du had also come to see you. If that Chu Hang keeps on making things difficult for a preparatory disciple, I am afraid he too will not be able to stay in the Pure Yang Palace, so you can feel relieved. Shang Yuan continued telling Yang Chen. No matter who the new manager is, I will tell him to attend to you as much as he can, so that you can continue living like you have these past few days, and no one will restrict you. Congratulations, elder brother, and many thanks elder brother. Yang Chen would also not betray Shang Yuan Feng's friendship. In his past life, Shang Yuan Feng had been someone who valued his friends, and in this life, since fate had brought them together, he would help Shang Yuan Feng. Although Shang Yuan Feng still had to leave for the inner court, afterwards they would become even closer friends. Immortal cultivation was a long road and there would be enough time later on, so he was not very anxious. After speaking with him, Shang Yuan Feng at once departed from the Yishu Manor, without stopping anywhere. After resting, Yang Chen also entered the quiet room for cultivation. He had to make others feel that he was hardworking and diligent. Without any other people by his side, Yang Chen finally stopped limiting himself and truly began to cultivate. The first method he cultivated was precisely that fire attributed cultivation method. He was already so familiar with this cultivation method, he could not do any better in it. 
Without any hindrances he succeeded in cultivating it in the first try. In his body, fire attributed spirit power started circulating around. Following which he cultivated the yin cultivation methods of the five phases one by one. In his previous life he had no contact with it and only had experience of the yang cultivation methods of the five phases. In each of the cultivation methods, he spent only a few days of time before he perfectly cultivated it. Every single day, Yang Chen only stopped to rest for a short time and then returned to the room to cultivate. Except a few servants in the profound pavilion, other people did not even see him. This pattern continued for about half a month. But this was still not sufficient. If Yang Chen's cultivation suddenly appeared to be at the first Kai Lair, this would appear very fast to other people. But he had already planned for this. Again continuing in the same manner, he directly cultivated the yin five phases and circulated them so that he could restrain his strength. Afterwards, carefully keeping the yin and yang five phases secrets under control, he cultivated them under the same circumstances. Until the yin and yang five phases secrets could be cultivated and could simultaneously attain a perfect equilibrium, Yang Chen estimated that he would have finally entered the first Kai layer by then. Thus when this happened, the timing would be very good and people would not feel any suddenness, nor would they think that he was stupid. If you are enjoying the content let a like, comment and subscribe to Fantasy World for more. Chapter 23 The new manager also cultivates. After deciding on his plans, just as Yang Chen was about to rest and order Shen Da to prepare food, suddenly something disturbed his thoughts. Letting his spiritual awareness drift, he quickly discovered someone hurriedly flying towards the profound palace, and his cultivation was at least at the 8 Kai layer above. To be able to fly over the Yishu Manor and have such a high cultivation, his identity was clear. This was surely the new manager of the Yishu Manor. At this moment he was hastily flying there, obviously he had been informed that Yang Chen had finally come out of seclusion. There was a rule that when cultivating in the cultivation room, if not for a very urgent matter, no one was allowed to disturb the cultivation of that person. Since the new senior disciple took his post, Yang Chen had never visited him. Clearly this new manager wanted to show his anger, and that was the only reason why he would rush to come here so fast at this time to meet him, or maybe he wanted to use Yang Chen as an example to show his strength. Yang Chen suddenly thought of something and fished out a thousand-year-old profound Yang fruit from his achievement ring. With a simple slash he divided it into two pieces, the pulp on the inside was bright red, resembling the color of blood. He took a bite out of the core and began to chew it loudly. Around this time, a man silhouette had already appeared at the entrance gate, just in time to look at this action. Wang Yuan was Yishu Manor's newly appointed manager and was also recommended by several uncle master of the Luminous Moon Hall, he was going to be responsible for handing out cultivation resources and deciding if the preparatory disciples had met the requirements for becoming outer disciples. The original manager, Shang Yuan Feng, had successfully reached the foundation stage and turned into an inner disciple, so he was chosen to be the next manager of the Yishu Manor, according to this logic. When the newly appointed manager had arrived, everyone in the Yishu Manor had gone to welcome him. Whether it was the preparatory disciples or the servants, all of them had greeted him, only a few individuals were exceptions. But they were all above the manager, and when the manager was taking office, they were all cultivating, so it was no wonder that they had neglected him. Naturally, a majority of those people had paid a visit to the new manager after their cultivation had ended, this kind of behavior made manager Wang Yuan quite pleased. However, from his arrival until now, one individual had not appeared before him, and that was precisely Yang Chen. With regards to Yang Chen, Wang Yuan had a huge headache. This time, Luminous Moon Hall's merit-transferring disciple, Chu Heng, had urged him repeatedly to use small tricks on Yang Chen and make sure that he would not be able to reach the first Kai layer in these three years and be demoted to a servant. However, his predecessor and foundation stage expert Shang Yuan Feng had also already met with him and told him that he must treat Yang Chen very well so that he would not suffer any grievances in any way. As soon as he took office, Wang Yuan clearly understood the attention Shang Yuan Feng paid towards Yang Chen. Not only did he live in the biggest residence, the profound pavilion, all by himself with the highest number of servants, he was also provided with the status of a third Kai layer disciple. If this was not paying attention, then what was? But Wang Yuan quickly realized that the status of a third Kai layer disciple was given by Chu Heng for his own benefit. Wang Yuan also quickly gained all of the information about the events how Yang Chen had offended him. Afterwards, Chu Heng wanted to get revenge, but also feared that people would speak about his immoral character, so he had no choice but to use this kind of trick. But, since he had become aware that Yang Chen had received guidance from Shang Yuan Feng and had used the trick of testing teachers to overcome Chu Heng's obstructions, Wang Yuan already realized that those hindrances of Chu Heng were virtually non-existent for Yang Chen. Later, if Yang Chen was not stupid, becoming an outer disciple was already within his grasp. 
However, the way he would treat Yang Chen would still depend on how Yang Chen treated him. If Yang Chen was tactful and discreet while facing him, then everything would be fine, but if Yang Chen talked arrogantly, then it would not be a surprise if Wang Yuan used small tricks on him. An 8 Kai layer master like him, dealing with a preparatory disciple who had not even reached the first Kai layer, even if Yang Chen had the support of 10,000 gods behind him, it would still not be enough to save him. When he received news that Yang Chen had come out, Wang Yuan dashed throughout the whole journey to come there. Just as he was about to enter, he saw a scene which almost caused his soul to fall apart. Yang Chen was holding something which absolutely resembled a profound Yang fruit, pulling it apart with his hands, he put it into his mouth to eat, with juices still dripping. Wang Yuan didn't even need to come closer, he could already sense the formidable spirit power accumulated in the peel thrown by Yang Chen. This, this is. Wang Yuan scuttled forward with a big stride to catch the peel that was conveniently thrown by Yang Chen in his direction, with his hands. He carefully observed it and determined that this was definitely a profound yang fruit and not just an ordinary one, but a fully developed thousand-year matured profound yang fruit. A thousand-year-old profound yang fruit. Unexpectedly Yang Chen was treating it like it was nothing, pulling it apart with his hands and throwing it into his mouth. At this moment, Wang Yuan's heart felt even more pain than if he had been cut by someone. What sort of wastrel would think of the eating the profound yang fruit uncooked and would even throw away its skin after peeling? This thousand-year profound yang fruit, if refined into a foundation pill, could directly promote someone to the foundation stage and was also able to remove all of the likely and unlikely problems. Clasping both of his hands around the pulp of the fruit, Yang Chen still looked like before, with the juices still dripping from his mouth. At this moment Wang Yuan hated Yang Chen so much, he wanted to kick the swastrel from the mountain and see how far he would roll. Wang Yuan caught the two fruit peels and resentfully asked Yang Chen. Do you know what this is? I don't know, only it was quite delicious, ah. Yang Chen replied, seeming disappointed that nothing of the fruit was left. He even extended his tongue to lick his lips, as if trying to get the aftertaste of the sweet pulp of the profound yang fruit. You don't? Wang Yuan almost roared. Don't tell me you have not learned about different herbs. I haven't learned anything, because nobody would teach me. Yang Chen innocently replied to Wang Yuan. Using a kind of tone which could make people really angry, he leisurely said. If I go to ask other people, they are not able to inform me. Oh wait, who are you? Only then had Wang Yuan remembered his purpose for coming here, and at the same time, when he heard Yang Chen's words, in his heart, he secretly became resentful towards Chu Heng for causing hindrances to trap Yang Chen. If it were not for him stopping Yang Chen from learning about different herbs, how could Yang Chen have destroyed this kind of precious herb? If he could have used this foundation pill for himself then he could have easily become an inner disciple. I am Wang Yuan, Yi Xu Manor's newly appointed manager. Wang Yuan finally pushed down his anger and told him of his identity. Even if he had not said it, Yang Chen would still have known. In the future this Wang Yuan would also become an inner disciple, and he would then rise to become Luminous Moon Hall's number two. So this is actually the newly appointed manager, I feel so honored by your rival, so disrespectful of me. Yang Chen hastily cupped his hands, admitting his sin. Then he ordered. Bring, tea. When Shen Da had finally brought the tea, Yang Chen directly threw the peel towards him and said. Shen Da, put that peel away, don't embarrass us in front of manager Wang Yuan. Shen Da hesitated for a moment when seeing Wang Yuan's reluctant expression, before finally letting go of the two fruit peels in his hands. When Shen Da put them on the tray and carried it inside, Yang Chen smilingly said. I found this fruit on the road when I was coming to join the sect, it was nothing special, it just had a delicious taste. If manager Wang also wants to eat some of this fruit, then give me the permission to go out. I will get some of these tasty fruits for manager Wang again. Hearing this, Wang Yuan's eyes opened wide, unexpectedly there were more of this thousand-year profound yang fruit. Listening to Yang Chen's tone, not only were there more of these thousand-year profound yang fruits, but it also seemed as if Yang Chen had been eating them incessantly. This time, Wang Yuan also understood the reason why Yang Chen's brute force surpassed disciples at the third Kai layer. Ah! Eating the pulp of these thousand years old profound yang fruits, who knew what magical effects it would have. Although Shen Da was just a servant, he still had very good common knowledge. When he heard Yang Chen's instructions, he believed it was some ordinary peel. But after seeing manager Wang Yuan's broken-hearted look, he thought more about it. Looking closely at the two peels, characteristics of different herbs flashed through his mind rapidly, and after some time, he finally somewhat determined what this thing was. Although he did not dare to be sure, looking at Wang Yuan's appearance, the remaining little bit of doubt disappeared. Compared with manager Wang Yuan's appearance, Shen Da's expression looked even more unbearable. This peel was definitely of the profound yang fruit, and this fruit had only been skinned a long time after it had matured, Shen Da lifelessly stood up. 
Carrying the tray he just stood at the same place, both eyes fixed on the peel, without moving an inch. This profound yang fruit's peel had three-tenths of the medicinal power of a profound yang fruit inside, even though it was not enough to manufacture foundation pills, the remaining medicinal power was still more than enough to manufacture a few extremely effective yang kai pills. Using these few yang kai pills, maybe he would be able to get past the third kai layer bottleneck and enter the fourth kai layer. Was such a thing really just given to him? Hearing Yang Chen's opinion, it was obviously so. However, Shen Da did not dare to believe it. His mind went buzzing until he heard Yang Chen's voice again. Ten thousand year profound Yang fruits, there were still more. Shen Da's whole body shook on the spot, and he blankly stood rooted to the ground, Wang Yuan was also stunned, not knowing what to say anymore. As for his original intentions for coming here, he had already locked and thrown them far away. What rebellious attitude, what consideration for elder brother Chu Heng's honor. Where would such a truthful and honest deal for a 10,000 year profound yang fruit be then? Even if Wang Yuan was already at the 8th Kai layer, he still had to stand up and gasp for breath several times, only then was he able to control his emotions, raising his head to look at Yang Chen he asked. These words, are you really not joking? Both happiness and alarm were spread across his face, yet he did not dare to be really convinced. This is just a fruit, nothing more, getting more of it is not a big deal. Yang Chen was laughing in his heart, but he nevertheless continued expertly. Manager Wang, if you need them, I will again ask you provide me with the permission to set out on a journey. If I did not have the confidence, I would not have dared to promise Manager Wang to get these fruits. After Yang Chen finished speaking, as if he was afraid that Wang Yuan would not trust him, he raised his hand to pledge. After I swear on my heart's devil, Manager will surely not doubt me anymore, right? Hearing Yang Chen unexpectedly swear on his heart's devil, Wang Yuan did not have any more doubts. What every cultivator feared most was an abnormal heart, especially this kind of a big oath. In case he made an oath on his heart's devil and his journey had no results, then the devil in his heart would grow inside of him, and his soul would have no more place to go. That's why ordinary cultivators would generally not dare to swear an oath on their heart's devil. In Yang Chen's opinion, the value of one profound Yang fruit was incomparable, if, in return, this Wang Yuan was able to show as much consideration as Shang Yuan Feng. Then Yang Chen would be able to spend these days in the Yishu Manor with ease. Also, Yang Chen did not mind giving him one fruit. Perhaps to other people it was quite precious, but Yang Chen had more than several thousands of them on his body and could obviously treat them just as a delicious fruits and nothing more. Good. Younger disciple Yang, if you have any problems in this Yishu manner, just find me. Wang Yuan directly put his hand on his chest to pledge. As long as your request is not too excessive, this Wang will not decline it. Manager Wang, can I ask something? What is this fruit in the end? Yang Chen smiled and somewhat cunningly asked him. If Yang Chen had not sworn the oath on his heart's devil, Wang Yuan could still find some means to keep a profound Yang fruit a secret, but now he absolutely could not do so, since the servant, Shen Da, was also present at the moment, so he started explaining. This is a thousand-year profound Yang fruit, which is used as the main ingredient to manufacture foundation stage pills. If this Wang had that 10,000-year profound Yang fruit, I would have been able to reach the foundation stage within the next 10 years. Still, many thanks, younger disciple Yang, for your generosity. You are too kind. Yang Chen pleasantly replied. Within his mind, he was already aware that if there was no accident, then as long as this Wang Yuan managed the Yishu Manor, no one would disturb him. Also, under the guise of receiving guidance from Shang Yuan Feng and Wang Yuan, even if he cultivated rapidly, it would not raise doubt in other people. After all, not everyone could treat a thousand-year profound Yang fruit as if it were just a fruit to eat. Wang Yuan quickly took his leave, but not before he gave some sort of guidance to Yang Chen. Even though he had rushed here in a rage, ultimately when he left, he had a large grin spread across his face. Yang Chen had just used a profound Yang fruit to achieve an effortless victory for himself. His initial plan to make a show of strength had instead turned into a joyous occasion. Yu Heng's arrangements no longer had any significance, or at least within the Yishu Manor they had no meaning. The manager had already fallen under Yang Chen, and the rest of the people also did not dare to talk rudely to Yang Chen, regardless of Chu Heng's instructions. Now Yang Chen was above all of the people in the Yishu Manor and could do whatever he wanted. It was just that Yang Chen had no time to waste on these pointless affairs. The sooner he rose to the foundation stage, the sooner Yang Chen could pay his respects under his master, and the sooner he could plan for a good way to deal with her matters, where did he have time to waste? Shen Da had been fortunate to the extreme, after receiving the two peels of the profound yang fruit, he coincidentally also found someone among the servants who could concoct basic pills and very low-level yang kai pills, but he could still concoct quite a few of them. 
although he could not monopolize both of the peels just gaining one would still be an enormous profit, at least now they could both dream of reaching the fourth layer. Knowing that these benefits had come from Yang Chen and also seeing the behavior of Wang Yuan towards Yang Chen, he, together with the other servants, started serving Yang Chen more obediently to completely satisfy Yang Chen. After settling the dispute with manager Wang, Yang Chen once again immersed himself into his crazy cultivation schedule. Since he had the experience and the foundation of the Yang Five Phases, to simultaneously practice Yin Five Phases, he merely had to spend a month's time. But he had always failed to grasp the main points of practicing both Yin and Yang Five Phases simultaneously, so even if Yang Chen had formidable spirit power, he had still only succeeded once in the last three months because of a fluke. After the first few tries, Yang Chen understood that to run, he first had to learn how to walk. After that, he tried to seek experience and look for a way, and eventually the number of times all five phases yin and yang could operate simultaneously increased, and the duration also became longer and longer, while at the same time his cultivation became more and more stable. Finally, one and a half year after he had entered the Yishu Manor, he had finally completed the introduction of the yin and yang, five phases secrets. Now Yang Chen could honorably claim to have reached the first Kai layer, and could also sincerely become a genuine outer disciple of the Pure Yang Palace. If you are enjoying the content let a like, comment and subscribe to Fantasy World for more. Chapter 24 Outer Disciple When Yang Chen finally emerged from the cultivation room after completing his training, he had already spent one year and four months at the Yishu Manor, including the number of days he had spent in the room. This whole time Yang Chen stayed in the room to train and only came out for little things, like eating and resting, and afterwards he went into the room again to cultivate. However during the cultivation of the yin and yang five phases secrets, Yang Chen came across an unforeseen difficulty. In the time he had spent training, he had cultivated the yin five phases in the first half of the month, while he was trying to harmonize the five phases of yin and yang, so that he could cultivate them simultaneously. To circulate the innate kai of the cultivation method, Yang Chen had to use his spiritual awareness, refined by the three purity secrets, to control it, and only then he was able to succeed. According to Yang Chen's prediction, by the time when he reached the next stage in the five phases of yin and yang cultivation, the difficulty would have increased at least several times. Fortunately, all things were difficult in the beginning, but since he had already grasped the basics of the cultivation method, his cultivation path would become quite smooth in the future. The cultivation he achieved with the five phases of yin and yang secrets was insufficient to refine the strength of the five phases of yin and yang to the next stage, the five phases of the great yin and yang secrets. Yang Chen had decided to name the ten types of cultivation method of the five yin and yang phases secrets. Regardless of which one of the ten cultivation methods he was training in, Yang Chen called them whatever he felt was suitable, and merely named them as first wood, second wood, third fire, fourth fire, fifth earth, sixth earth, seventh metal, eighth metal, ninth water and tenth water. These were the ten types of spirit power. Naturally, to others it appeared as if Yang Chen was currently cultivating the fire-centered method which he had received from the achievement room in the Yishu Manor. These days, the great manager of the Yishu Manor, Wang Yuan, paid great attention to Yang Chen. Not only were each month's gifts provided to him in sufficient quantity and on time, but it was also very likely that the manager kept watch at Yang Chen's profound pavilion every month for several days. Every time when the manager was overseeing, he would also provide Yang Chen with guidance related to cultivation methods and all kinds of basic knowledge. Being treated so highly made people envy him. When Yang Chen came out from his training, Wang Yuan was already waiting for him at the profound pavilion. Half a month ago, Yang Chen had said that he was entering closed-door training and that he already had some certainty. But apparently Wang Yuan was totally certain about this, so today he had already been waiting here for Yang Chen. After he saw Yang Chen, both of his eyes shone brightly, after only examining him once he already started congratulating him. After meeting with Yang Chen today, Wang Yuan had felt something acutely different. On Yang Chen's body he could clearly sense fire attributed spirit power, this was a clear indication of successfully reaching the Kai realm. Previously Yang Chen had to use the reverse five phases cultivation method to suppress his spirit power, but finally, after today he would no longer need that sort of cover-up. After entering the Yishu Manor, even though he had to learn everything from scratch while dealing with several obstructions arranged by Chu Heng at the same time, Yang Chen had still achieved the minimum requirement of reaching the first Kai layer, in the brief period of one and a half years, now nobody would be able to say that his comprehension ability was weak. As for those preparatory disciples who had entered together with him into Yishu Manor, not one of them had succeeded in reaching the first Kai layer, this clearly showed Yang Chen's superiority. Although Yang Chen's basic knowledge seemed to be insufficient to others, no one could stop him from entering the ranks of the outer disciples of the Pure Yang Palace. 
Even if the merit transferring disciple Chu Hang was present, he would also be unable to do anything. Yang Chen clearly understood Wang Yuan's intentions, and he had already sworn the oath on his heart's devil, so Wang Yuan was not worried that he would go back on his promise, but even so, he still had to resist the pressure from Chu Hang, and he defended Yang Chen in all kinds of matters. This time was also the same, Wang Yuan had already made some preparations to congratulate Yang Chen when he reached the boundary of First Kai Lair, long ago. He clapped to signal the two servants behind the door to enter. Both of them were carrying a tray. Of these two servants, one was a man and the other a woman, the man was Shen Da, and the woman was the female servant who had used the illusion talisman. Both of them were carrying a tray in their hands, each. One tray held a beautiful pouch, while the other one was fully packed with spirit stones. This is for you. After you have become qualified to the Nine Earth Manor, my teacher has made this Kiankin pouch for you. Wang Yuan grabbed and threw that Kiankin pouch into Yang Chen's hands and introduced it very enthusiastically. You only have to put a mark of your spiritual awareness into it, then you can use it. In his heart Yang Chen was very calm, but on the surface, he showed a surprised expression when receiving the Kiankin bag, and in accordance with Wang Yuan's instructions, he used his spiritual awareness to brand it. Soon after that he pretended to feel some kind of difference and began to browse the inside. Wang Yuan did not trouble Yang Chen this time. When he had received his own Kiankin pouch for the first time, he was also like this and unable to contain his joy, so he absolutely understood Yang Chen's mood right now. After waiting until he had fiddled enough with the pouch, Wang Yuan handed him the spirit stones on the second tray and said. Since Uncle Master Chu has said that you will have the status of a third Kai Layer disciple, you will receive one Jin of spirit stones every month, then. Previously you had no expenses, so you were not given any money, but now all of the spirit stones, from the time when you joined the sect until today, will be supplied to you. Yang Chen was not impolite and received them to put them into the his new Kiankin pouch. As soon as Yang Chen was finished with everything, he dismissed all of the servants. Only then did Wang Yuan ask. Younger disciple Yang, are you planning to go to the Nine Earth Manor right away, or do you intend to stay in the Yishu Manor for some more time? In my opinion, my generation of cultivators is a little bit more mild and honest in comparison. Now that Yang Chen was officially an outer disciple, according to common sense, he would naturally go to the Nine Earth Manor, where almost all outer disciple practiced cultivation. Only now that Chu Hang was acting as the merit transferring disciple, it may be assumed that he would also try to use any way to take care of Yang Chen there. If he stayed at Yishu Manor, he would enjoy special consideration. But every matter had its own merits and demerits. If he continued to stay at the Yishu Manor, he would have to wait for the three-year period to come to an end, but Chu Hang would also be nearing the end of his term as the merit-transferring disciple and would be replaced with someone else. At most, he could waste Yang Chen's one and a half year, but it was also possible that he might not need to directly confront Chu Hang and could cultivate calmly. Even if the Nine Earth Manor had Chu Hang, almost all others there were outer disciples. No matter whether it were the cultivation methods, the allocation of resources and spirit stones or the interaction between outer disciples, all of them were far better when compared to the Yishu Manor. After all, the Yishu Manor was only to teach the preparatory disciples. Even if he had Wang Yuan to guide him, it could still not be compared to the directions given by Foundation Stage Inner Disciples. Moreover, compared to the Yishu Manor, the Nine Earth Manor was rich in spiritual influence, which also had many advantages for cultivating. If it weren't for Chu Hang, going to the Nine Earth Manor was the best choice. But just because of Chu Hang, Wang Yuan was asking for Yang Chen's opinion. We cultivators always welcome difficulties, if, just because of one person, Uncle Master Chu, I bind my steps and not go forward, I will just remain a mediocre person in my entire life. Yang Chen was aware of Wang Yuan's meaning, but he still didn't accept Wang Yuan's good intentions, but rather resolving himself, he simply said. Today, if I cower, then in the future I will also shrink back from everything, it could also be assumed that I am simply unworthy of senior disciple Wang's attention and care. So I will ask senior disciple Wang to make the arrangements that I may leave for the Nine Earth Manor in a few days. In his previous life, just because Yang Chen had that kind of cowardly nature, he had ended up like that in the end, in this life he would not repeat the same mistakes. These short few sentences left an indescribable feeling in Wang Yuan and also unknowingly stirred some kind of heroic emotions in him. Well said. Younger disciple Yang, I appreciate your feelings, wait for 10 days, and after 10 days, I will have my people see you off to the Nine Earth Manor. Originally Wang Yuan was a mild type of person which resembled Yang Chen's impression of him in his previous life. He didn't have too much of a desire to fight, if not, it would have been unlikely for him to be sent to supervise the Yishu Manor. 
but Yang Chen's words had caused some kind of enlightenment to flash in his mind, restricting his insecure feelings, which had constantly made him think of his shortcomings and so on, but now Wang Yuan felt that his cultivation energy faintly vibrated, appearing as if he was about to break through at any moment. This sensation made him both excited and expectant. This type of enlightenment was an opportunity that would appear seldomly, he could not do anything about Yang Chen's affairs and could only push away these matters for several days. Moreover, even if he immediately went to arrange everything, Yang Chen could still not become an outer disciple right away. Every sect had its rules, and Yang Chen clearly understood the rules of the Pure Yang Palace. If a preparatory disciple, who has met the required criterion, wanted to become an official outer disciple, there had to be a ceremony, and only then could he be considered to have genuinely entered the sect. All outer disciples and the merit transferring disciple had a ceremonial relation of being master and disciple. Sun Hai Jing and Chu Heng had precisely this kind of relation between them in the beginning, but after looking at Sun Hai Jing's spirit route, it was determined that in the future, he would also enter the luminous moon hall, so naturally he started to curry favor with Chu Heng, and Chu Heng in return started to pay attention to him. Thus the relationship between the two individuals became more intimate when compared to others. Even if Wang Yuan wrote a writ to send the news, he would still have to wait for several days before Yang Chen could leave. Yang Chen was also not very anxious to go and use this time to make some talisman papers. After sending off Wang Yuan, Shen Da arrived in front of Yang Chen, appearing very respectful. After the last time when Yang Chen had beaten them unconscious, Shen Da had always treated Yang Chen this way. As soon as Yang Chen had been properly seated, Shen Da fished out a small jade bottle from his Kiankin pouch and very respectfully handed it to Yang Chen. What is this? Yang Chen didn't extend his hand to take it, but rather looked at it and asked in great surprise. Young Master Yang, these are Yang Kai pills, refined from the profound Yang fruit from the last time. Shen Da explained quickly. This belonged to Young Master Yang's initially, now I am returning them to Young Master Yang. Explaining all of this, Shen Da finally placed the jade bottle on the table in front of Yang Chen. Yang Chen stared at Shen Da for a good amount of time, then he shook his head and said. You should use them, it isn't that useful to me. Shen Da became very anxious, why didn't Yang Chen accept the bottle, did he still doubt them? After Yang Chen defeated him empty-handedly, Shen Da had conceded sincerely, but he was an intelligent person and had known that immediately after the fight, Shang Yuan Feng had entered closed-door training, and after just two months he succeeded in building his foundation, becoming an inner disciple. And today he personally saw Wang Yuan and Yang Chen discussing something, and after that Wang Yuan had also hurriedly entered closed-door training, it would be a miracle if there was nothing fishy about it. Thinking about Yang Chen's behavior around the two appointed managers, it was not difficult for Shen Da to understand that they must have gained some huge benefits from Yang Chen. If not, how could they agree to offend the inner disciple Uncle Master Chu and face his anger just to assist Yang Chen? Moreover, Shen Da had also recognized that fruit peel, the profound Yang fruits peel, which had been in Yang Chen's possession. What this implied was self-evident. If he did not embrace Yang Chen's leg at this time, then after Yang Chen left the Yishu Manor, he would not get any more opportunities like this. Shen Da and all of the other servants who had been beaten in that last fight had discussed it, and afterwards Holin had refined the fruit peels to produce this Yang Kai pill, but rather than swallowing it, they offered it to him today. Seeing that Yang Chen did not receive it, Shen Da knelt down immediately without thinking and respectfully said, Young Master Yang, we are aware that Young Master has boundless prospects, and in the past we have offended you, so we request the superior Young Master to punish us. I have already forgotten about that affair. Yang Chen laughed. He already didn't have enough time to cultivate, how could a few servants possibly make life difficult for him? He was not a narrow-minded person like Chu Heng. Young Master, we four people only desire to be able to serve Young Master. Chen Da did not hide anything and directly told his request to Yang Chen. While he was speaking, outside of the door the three people appeared in a flash and moved in front of Yang Chen and knelt down beside Shen Da in a row. These three people were Ho Lin, Ting Yuan and Gu Qin, precisely the servants who had been beaten by Yang Chen in the beginning. Actually, Yang Chen hadn't expected this kind of event as, regarding these four people, he didn't harbor any ill will in his heart. Although these these four people had initially acted against him under Chu Heng's arrangements, after going through Yang Chen's lesson, they had sincerely served him without any mistakes. Yang Chen was quite satisfied regarding this. Now these four wanted to follow Yang Chen to follow his future development and also to borrow an opportunity to advance themselves. All of them wanted to move forward and Yang Chen was unlikely to obstruct their progress. In any case, these four could easily be employed as among the servants their cultivation was considered quite profound. Yang Chen also didn't care whether they were following him as in the Nine Earth Manor, he would also get servants to serve him. 
Seeing that Yang Chen was still thinking, all four of them glanced at each other and soon after that groveled in front of him and uniformly said. Please permit us, young master Yang. After a moment when these four had saluted Yang Chen by kowtown, they heard Yang Chen's promising voice. Okay. Get up. Just as these four people delightedly got up, they discovered that the jade bottle containing the Yang Kai pills which they gifted to Yang Chen was still on the table before them. Young master, these originally belonged to you, we only refined them, that's all. Naturally Shen Da and the others did not dare to request for this kind of thing, they only wanted Yang Chen to give them a few pointers when the occasion arrived, just that would already be sufficient. Which of you refined this? Holin. Yang Chen asked as he glanced at Holin. Holin hastily nodded. Yang Chen laughingly reached out his hand for the jade bottle and took out a pill. After cautiously inspecting it for some time, a small flame suddenly appeared above his finger and wrapped around the pill in his hand. It was just a Yang Kai pill, nothing more. It didn't even require Yang Chen to use the Supreme Elder's pill secrets and profound pill scriptures skill. Although Yang Chen's flame was small, after a moment, that pill had already started burning and broke into small pieces. Soon after that there were more than 10 medicinal pills within the bottle. After that, Yang Chen took out all of them and also formed them into more Yang Kai pills, which he then loaded into the jade bottle and placed before the four people again. The Yang Kai pills were slightly unrefined. I just dispelled a few impurities. Seeing that those four were still somewhat hesitant to receive them, Yang Chen once again said laughingly. This stuff really has no use for me, you can take them. Those four exchanged a glance again and only then did Shen Da reach out his hands to take the jade bottle, as if he was receiving some precious treasure. After Hou Lin had witnessed what just happened, his eyes were filled with worship towards Yang Chen. The person who could refine a pill empty-handedly and extract the pill medicine, even if it was just a Yang Kai pill, his future prospects couldn't be measured. Oh right, Shen Da, your cultivation base is not bad, in the evening, just take two Yang Kai pills and directly swallow them, maybe with a sudden burst of energy you will able to break through and cross the bottleneck of the third Kai layer. Yang Chen advised Shen Da. Properly meditate and feel the cultivation energy, and if you hold the medicine in your mouth for half of the time, you will have a chance of at least 70% for success. If you are enjoying the content let a like, comment and subscribe to Fantasy World for more. Chapter 25 You Are Not Professional. After hearing this, Shen Da was in seventh heaven, his guess had finally turned out to be true, although Yang Chen had the strength of the mere first Kai layer, he still had an omniscient vision. He could easily see everyone's cultivation bottleneck and furthermore also give directions about how to break through. Shang Yuan Feng had been this way, Wang Yuan was also the same, and now it was finally his turn. At first, he was somewhat suspicious of Yang Chen after he had discovered that Yang Chen had a highly retentive mind. But he had never raised the subject in front of other people. But now, after listening to Yang Chen's words, even if others were to consider him stupid, he would always serve by Yang Chen's side. For a moment, the other three servants looked at Shen Da with an envious gaze. Shen Da had so easily received Yang Chen's guidance, but they did not know when they could also receive this kind of opportunity. Shen Da your accumulation of Kai is already sufficient, you are merely not aware of the method to break through. Yang Chen glimpsed at Holin, Ting Yuan and Gu Qin and knew what they were thinking and said. You are all still lacking, try hard. Yes young master. These three people woke up to reality and simultaneously saluted Yang Chen. After Yang Chen finished speaking, he didn't dismiss them, but rather raised his hand, and a ball of flame appeared again. The delicate flame on Yang Chen's hand began to transform into a variety of forms, one moment it turned into a thin thread of fire, another moment it transformed into a ball of fire, and then in another moment it yet again turned into a realistic animal, made up of fire. In Yang Chen's hand, the flame seemed as if it had come alive. When the four servants saw Yang Chen's effortless control over the fire, they were so that's why Yang Chen could refine the Yang Kai pill's impurities so easily, this exceedingly great mastery over a high-level fire-controlling skill, even if it was an inner disciple who had reached the foundation stage, it would still surpass them. All of the four servants felt this way, their admiration towards Yang Chen grew enormously. Sometimes, cultivation is not only for fighting. Yang Chen's words timely echoed in the ears of the four servants. Think about some other paths to follow, it will broaden your horizon. Afterwards, when cultivating, don't just stick to acquiring formidable magic power, control is also very important. Only when Yang Chen reached the Jindan stage in his previous life did he realize this, of course in this life, he would not repeat the same mistake. Only, in the ears of the four people listening, these words were like a morning bell which had awoken them to an all-new world. Originally they cultivated with all their might in order to break through to the next realm and to be able to have valiant fighting strength, but now they discovered they had already diverged from the main road. Many thanks, young master for giving us directions. 
the four people wholeheartedly paid their respects to Yang Chen. This time, Yang Chen didn't stop them, and with a wave of his hand he instructed them to leave. Then he started assimilating the magic power surging within his body and began to refine it. Before going to the Nine Earth Manor, he should manufacture a few talismans. Talismans require even higher level material and even more formidable magic power to manufacture, the principle was the same as talisman papers, but a talisman had, at least, two to three times more power. Before, Yang Chen could not obtain the materials for the talisman, so he had no other choice but to use talisman papers, but now he could consider making a talisman. While Yang Chen was refining, within the Nine Earth Manor of the Pure Yang Palace at the Miking Mountain, the merit transferring disciple on duty, Chu Hang, was angry at Yishu Manor's manager Wang Yuan's writ. That preparatory disciple, Yang Chen, who had been recruited last year, that guy who was an executioner. Within the short period of just one and a half years he had managed to pass the boundary of the first Kai Lair, and within several days, he would be sent to the Nine Earth Manor. Ju Hang was a very prideful person and felt that if he personally dealt with an ordinary mortal using his status as a foundation stage disciple, he would lose all of his face. But because of the task entrusted to him by Greatest Heaven Sex Li King Chen, he had ordered Sun Hai Jing to intentionally make things difficult for Yang Chen at the time the sect was recruiting disciples so that Yang Chen would not get any opportunity whatsoever, but after that, Du Qian unexpectedly appeared and Yang Chen used this chance to beat Sun Hai Jing. Firmly smashing Chu Hang's prestige. Soon afterwards Chu Heng told everything to the two managers of the Yishu Manor and asked them to create hindrances for Yang Chen, the rules determined by him were also properly implemented in the Yishu Manor. But even with these circumstances, not only was Yang Chen still able to cultivate and reach the first Kai Lair, but he was also the first one to achieve this among the 20 disciples in the first year, this really made him furious. Originally he believed that with the help of the two managers who were handling this affair and the rules he had already declared, which no one would dare to break, he would be able to handle Yang Chen, but now it seemed as if they didn't have any effect. He did not know who the person who had helped Yang Chen was, but if ever he found out, he would make that person pay. However, right now he had to seriously think about the matter of dealing with Yang Chen. Allowing Yang Chen to become an outer disciple would certainly mean that he was breaking his promise and Chu Heng could not allow this kind of thing to occur. But Yang Chen had already reached the first Kai Lair, and he could do nothing to block him. So right now, the only thing Chu Hang could do was to go to Sun Hai Jing and inform him about this news. You have to prevent that Yang Chen from reaching the Nine Earth Manor. Chu Hang coldly placed his request and turned around to leave. You can use any method, I don't care about it, but you cannot let anyone discover that you are the one breaking the sex rules, otherwise even I will not be able to save you. Of course, whatever you do, I know nothing of it, do you understand? Sun Hai Jing hastily nodded and respectfully replied. Yes master. Who? A ray of light flew from Chu Hang's hand directly toward Sun Hai Jing. This is a cultivation tool for you to refine, you should refine it as soon as possible, it will provide some extra assistance with your strength. Furthermore, take these spirit stones with you, as the payment. Many thanks master. Sun Hai Jing rejoiced and once again loudly expressed his thanks, following the respectful behavior a disciple had towards his master. Only after Chu Heng had completely disappeared did Sun Hai Jing lift his head, a malicious smile was spread across his face, in both of his eyes was a mysterious expression. After 10 days Yang Chen would leave the Yishu Manor to go to the Nine Earth Manor. The Miking Mountain was very large, the distance between the Yishui Manor and the Nine Earth Manor would require a full five-day journey on foot for an ordinary person. Even if he was a first Kai Lair outer disciple, he hadn't learned any flying or soaring technique beforehand, so he would need approximately three days time to complete the journey. This amount of time was enough for Sun Hai Jing to plan some mishaps. A memory from one and a half years ago, when Yang Chen had beaten him unconscious in front of many fellow disciples, gave rise to a strong feeling of rage in Sun Hai Jing's mind. If it were not for the other outer disciples and Yang Chen being at Yishu Manor, Sun Hai Jing would have already taken Yang Chen's life. But now, with Chu Heng's support, Sun Hai Jing would absolutely not let Yang Chen live long enough to enter the Nine Earth Manor. For the next 10 days, Yang Chen didn't train, but only made a few talismans. When he was preparing these talismans, others were not around, so naturally, nobody knew that, apart from fire spirit energy, he could also cultivate all other spirit energies. These few high-grade talismans had been nourished by Yang Chen through the universal treasure raising secrets, compared to normal talismans they have quite a formidable power. After seven days, Shen Da came out of his closed-door training, a cheerful look was spread across his entire face, and the expression in his eyes was also a lot brighter. He had finally crossed through to the fourth Kai layer in one stroke, with the help of Yang Chen's directions and the impact of the three Yang Kai pills. 
The trace of envy rose in Holin, Tingyuan and Gu Qin when they saw the look in Shen Da's eyes, but at the same time a lot of expectations arose in their hearts. What Shen Da experienced today, they could experience tomorrow, the only condition was that they also received Yang Chen's guidance like Shen Da. On the ninth day, the whole of Yishu Manor heard manager Wang Yuan's long and excited howl. Together with the howl, Wang Yuan's silhouette appeared in the sky and directly pounced towards the profound pavilion. Ah ha ha ha. Similar to when Shang Yuan Feng had succeeded in building his foundation, Wang Yuan also arrived at the profound pavilion and burst out laughing. Younger disciple Yang, your words from that time have allowed this senior disciple to finally attain the ninth Kai layer. Yang Chen hurriedly appeared to welcome him, listening to Wang Yuan's words, he repeatedly congratulated him. Again, this is thanks to younger disciples' blessings. Wang Yuan gently laughed and cupped his hands to greet Yang Chen, soon afterwards he glanced at Shen Da, who was standing behind Yang Chen. He was quite surprised and only after examining him for a good moment did he nod towards Shen Da and said. Congratulations Shen Da, you are certainly hardworking, you will go far. This is all due to young master Yang's guidance. Shen Da hastily replied. He was a servant, his status was quite different from a disciple. And so he did not dare to claim any credit for himself. Oh, young master Yang's vision is surely like a beacon. Wang Yuan was not very surprised, apparently he had already guessed that Shang Yuan Feng's success in building his foundation had something to do with Yang Chen. This all depended on senior disciples' previous guidance, all I did was listen to senior disciples' words and just repeated some of them, that's all. Yang Chen said a few modest words and pushed the credit onto Wang Yuan. After talking about these matters, Wang Yuan said. Younger disciple Yang, early tomorrow morning, I will arrange for people to escort you to the Nine Earth Manor, unfortunately, this senior disciple is a manager, so I don't have the authority to leave without permission, otherwise I would personally escort you. I don't dare to trouble senior disciple. Yang Chen politely refused, then spoke again. Your little brother has a request. These few servants have been serving me without much trouble for more than a year, so I would like to bring them with me to the Nine Earth Manor, hopefully this does not inconvenience senior disciple. What inconvenience? Just take them along with you. Wang Yuan did not consider this as any problematic affair. All official disciples could keep their own servants, whom they were accustomed to. However, he actually envied the luck of Shen Da and the other people. Whether it was the Yishu Manor or the Nine Earth Manor, both had servants, some of them even had a higher cultivation than the official disciples. These people were originally also disciples, but since their natural talent was lacking, their future prospects were limited, and because of that they were forced to become servants, but all of them had been cultivating for a long time, and many have reached the ninth Kai layer or even the pinnacle of the Kai realm. Speaking of the official disciples, having a servant whose cultivation was higher than them both encouraged and provoked them to put more effort into training. This method was not something special, rather it was commonly used by almost all sects. On one hand it arranged for those defeated disciples with low comprehension to settle down, while at the same time it also provided an incentive for the new disciples, it was indeed killing two birds with one stone. Since Yang Chen had asked for these four servants, when Wang Yuan sent them off on their way on the next morning, besides one servant who was leading the way to the Nine Earth Manor, behind Yang Chen, the two male and two female servants followed. The Miking Mountain was entirely under Pure Yang Palace's control, the mountain range extended over a circumference of around a thousand miles. The Yishu Manor was considered to be the region with the smallest amount of spiritual influence. The Nine Earth Manor was situated 400 miles into the Miking Mountain and had far denser spiritual influence. The servant leading the way did not talk much and kept his head down while walking. Among them, only Yang Chen was of the first Kai layer, so he was not able to fly or soar and could only walk, step by step, towards the Nine Earth Manor. However when he reached the second Kai layer, he would be able to refine some flying talismans or possibly a paper crane or some other thing for transportation. At that time his speed would increase by a lot. There were no problems during the first day, they had been walking with their full strength throughout the way, rushing as much as 200 miles, before stopping to meditate and circulate the Kai within their bodies. They were only resting for one hour before hastening on with their journey throughout the night. In the night, the light from the sky was not very good since the starlight was almost insufficient. Fortunately, the leading servant was very familiar with the way and the road to the Nine Earth Manor was only a straight path so they were unlikely to lose their way. Anyway, after walking for two hours, when the color of the sky was faintly brightening, suddenly Yang Chen sensed something peculiar. It seemed as if the spirit power in the surroundings was slightly stronger than usual. An average person would in no way take note of such a small difference, but Yang Chen raised his vigilance and at the same time he to gestured Shen Da and the others running behind him to be careful. 
these four didn't doubt him and immediately got ready, putting their hands on their weapons and began to alertly observe their surroundings. Apparently the servant walking ahead didn't notice anything wrong and kept on walking as always. Although he did not turn around, he knew what was happening behind him and thought that Shen Da's and other four's vigilance was utterly ridiculous. This was Pure Yang Palace's territory, who would dare to cause trouble here. After walking ten more steps forward, suddenly something flashed before everyone's eyes and all of them discovered that, although they were all still standing at the same place, the others had already disappeared without a trace. Since they were already prepared, Shen Da and the others immediately took out their weapons, but there was not a soul in sight and they were not aware of the enemy's location. Yang Chen halted at his original position and didn't move a step, he merely turned his head to look left and right, then, facing in some direction he started to talk. You have come for me, right? For a mere outer disciple, you actually have very acute senses. Suddenly an erratic voice spread from the direction Yang Chen was facing. Someone has paid me ten spirit stones and allowed me to take all the items on your body in exchange for your life. Now, leave for the netherworld. You must not confuse me as your personal enemy. Listening to you, it seems you are not a professional. Yang Chen suddenly sneered. These words are entirely wrong. Oh? Then what would be the right words? The person hidden in the darkness didn't immediately attack, but rather curiously asked Yang Chen. I have always thought that my words were not sufficiently formidable, maybe you can help me change it into something better. A professional should speak like this. A smiling expression appeared on Yang Chen's face. Advancing one step he started speaking. For every debt there is a debtor, you and I have no past grudges, nor recent hatred, you can only blame your employer and your own greed for committing this offense. If you are enjoying the content let a like, comment and subscribe to Fantasy World for more. Chapter 26 Five levels of difference can still be surpassed. Bang. Following Yang Chen's words, an inflammation talisman suddenly exploded in front of him. This fire attributed talisman had the highest attack power among all of the talismans Yang Chen had made and was also nourished by the universal treasure raising secrets. Although the sound wasn't particularly loud, it directly impacted a circumference of 10 meters around the explosion. Suddenly, a human reflection flickered inside of the impact zone as it was engulfed by the formidable power of the inflammation talisman, and at the same time a frightened cry resounded, immediately followed by a blood-curdling scream. A person's silhouette appeared to be writhing inside of the ocean of fire. Impossible, how could you find me? A terrified voice came from within the ocean of fire. The voice was full of pain, apparently he was seriously injured by Yang Chen's inflammation talisman. Because this rotten illusion of yours can only disturb my senses a little and has absolutely no effect on my mind. Yang Chen coldly smiled. Suddenly Yang Chen turned around and swung his fist. The shadow of a person that sneakily appeared behind his body was suddenly hit with his fist and it flipped over in the air for a few times as if it was sitting on a roller coaster and fell onto the ground. Then suddenly it just disappeared, seemingly melting into the background. After this strike, the silhouette within the ocean of flame also disappeared and together with it, the blood-curdling scream. Apart from the sound of combustion of the blaze, left behind by the explosion of the inflammation talisman, nothing could be heard. Yang Chen didn't grow overconfident as his fist couldn't kill the other party. The other party was at least still capable of fleeing under his repeated punches, but the enemy had already made it clear that his strength was a lot higher than Shen Da and the others, having a strength of around the 6 Kai layer. Not coming out. Yang Chen surveyed everything around him and then suddenly asked this. If you are not coming out, then I am going. Going? The fleeting voice of the hidden person was heard once again, but due to the fuzzy noise, Yang Chen was unable to determine the location of the person. Humph, why don't you try to walk away in front of me? Without paying any attention to the other party's scornful remarks, Yang Chen started walking forward with large strides. Along with Yang Chen's large strides, the scenery kept changing incessantly. At this very moment, the enemy had discovered that Yang Chen had not been affected by the illusions previously, so he unleashed all of his might into the illusionary spell. However, this was a real illusionary spell, not like the illusionary talisman used by Holin. Its power was truly incomparable with the one Holin used. But with Yang Chen's strong-willed spiritual awareness, he was still able to stop the illusion from affecting him. Therefore, the last two attacks had basically no effect, but the enemy had used the spell to suit his needs, so he could use illusionary copies of himself in those last two mirages and escape. This time, an inferno of fire appeared before Yang Chen's eyes. The fire inferno surroundings were incomparably bright. Within the inferno, the enemy was waiting for his chance to kill him. Facing the sea of fire, Yang Chen sneered loudly and kept on moving forward, stepping into the raging blazes. With a bang sound, the violent blazes, together with a scorching wave of air, moved towards Yang Chen, engulfing everything in its way. 
this attack was not an illusion, rather an absolutely genuinely produced attack within the fantasy land. But from Yang Chen's perspective, flames could be seen everywhere, when suddenly a white light flashed, accompanied by a long and loud laugh. A white-colored fog completely surrounded Yang Chen. Yang Chen had promptly unleashed his frost talisman. The water attributed frost talisman emitted a cold air which was rapidly extinguished the fire. It froze all of the surrounding blazes without any decrease in magic power and covered the ground with Horfrost. Within the Horfrost, a figure flashed with dazzling rays, and Yang Chen's spiritual awareness immediately locked onto the former. The enemy's image faded away in a moment, without any traces, but Yang Chen's hand also was not slow. He immediately took out the Thousand Jin Talisman, and it covered the entire region straight away. With its earth attributed magic power, a Thousand Jin Talisman was very easy to make, but Yang Chen's Thousand Jin Talisman was not an ordinary one. Originally the enemy was concealed within the illusions and so wanted to use his martial techniques rapidly, together with the illusions, to hide and at the same time attack Yang Chen, but after Yang Chen used the Thousand Jin Talisman on this large area, his speed immediately dropped. In a split second, the enemy used his own magic power to break free from the influence of the Thousand Jin Talisman. But this was already enough for Yang Chen to lock his spiritual awareness on him. Whoosh. Finally the enemy came up with a killer move. A yellow-colored light appeared within the range of Yang Chen's spiritual awareness. It was rapidly flying towards Yang Chen at a high speed, without making even the least bit of noise. Looking at it, it only seemed to be a yellow-colored light. Bing. The yellow-colored light directly knocked against Yang Chen's body. The outline of an armor faintly appeared on his body. The yellow-colored light was unable to penetrate and returned without having achieved anything. The shell talisman. The hidden enemy clenched his teeth and asked. You are just a first Kai Layer disciple, how come you have so many talismans? He had thought that a first Kai Layer disciple together with five third Kai Layer servants would have no way of fleeing as long as they were to enter his illusionary spell. Now those third Kai Layer servants were all trapped very well within the illusionary spell, but this master whom he had believed to be the easiest one to dispose of had put him in such a difficult position and even his talisman tool had been of no use. The yellow-colored light within his hand was actually a high-grade symbol sword which he had incidentally purchased in an auction. Its attack speed was very quick, but the attack power was comparatively not that great. But this was already the most powerful tool he had for disposing of someone, but it failed by a mere slight resistance from Yang Chen's shell talisman. What sort of shell talisman could be so difficult to deal with? This symbol sword was made by a person who was at the pinnacle of the Kai realm, but it was surprisingly defeated by a shell talisman made by Yang Chen, a first Kai layer disciple. To him this was simply the biggest mystery under the sky. Astonished, at the same time, the killer also started fearing him. Someone who had such a formidable shell talisman couldn't possibly be an ordinary person, the only thing that could explain this kind of event was that this youngster had the favor of some great person. If he had known that this trip would be so dangerous, he would not have accepted such a small amount of spirit stones. Although this shell talisman was difficult to deal with, it was not Yang Chen's own power, and after its magic power was exhausted, this shell talisman would be worthless. But the talisman tool was different, when using it, he could supply it with his own magic power, so the killer was completely convinced that he could supply his own tool, until Yang Chen's shell talisman ran out of magic power. The killer had a good plan, but he hadn't anticipated that Yang Chen had already locked his spiritual awareness onto his position. After blocking the symbol sword, Yang Chen had taken out the five golden blades talisman. Raising his hand, five golden colored rays flew out like a sword towards the killer's position. The killer hadn't anticipated that Yang Chen still had this kind of attack left and he was excessively surprised, but he knew that he had to evade it. The five golden blade talisman's attack was similar to a sword. If it were to hit, that would be no small matter. The killer had already experienced Yang Chen's attacks many times and had discovered that the talismans in Yang Chen's hand were enormously formidable, thus, he dared not receive it and hurriedly tried to evade. However Yang Chen's five direction golden blades were extremely well coordinated, they had actually sealed him from the left and right and there was a mountain wall behind him. Stuck in the middle, the killer could only go towards Yang Chen and quickly take care of him. But the killer hadn't thought about why Yang Chen used the five blades golden talisman precisely at this position. Yang Chen was waiting just for this moment so that he could take advantage of the killer's forward momentum. He also moved forward and a heaven-splitting killing intent erupted from Yang Chen and struck the killer who was rushing over. Even if he was a killer, the killing intent emitted by Yang Chen could even greatly startle a departed spirit. At this moment, it seemed as if he was facing a death god from the 18th level of hell, during this time, even his limbs stopped complying with his wishes. At this moment, even if Yang Chen would just walk towards the killer and use some simple skill, it would already be sufficient to kill him. 
While rushing forward, Yang Chen fished out his executioner's blade from his achievement ring, and after nearing the killer, he simply waved it towards the killer's head. The executioner's blade streaked across the killer's neck without any resistance. Even though the killer was already at the Six Kai Lair, and even though he didn't forget to protect his body with magic power for even a single moment, after Yang Chen had painstakingly carved a few golden blade talismans on the knife and it had become a talisman tool, these measures had become completely useless. Hi. Bright blood spurted out from the cavity formed from severing the head. But, Yang Chen had already moved towards the side, so not even a single drop fell onto him. From slashing the knife, withdrawing the knife and moving out of the way, all of it happened within the blink of an eye, and the majestic Six Kai Lair assassin had his body and head separated. Although the killer had died, the illusionary spell still hadn't disappeared yet, and Yang Chen was as before still inside of it. Standing at his the original position, Yang Chen carefully swept his gaze around his surroundings. After determining the position of the illusionary talisman, he walked towards it and started his work. Although this illusionary talisman had quite a good effect in Yang Chen's eyes, it was not all that great. Using his great principle gold in Immortal's foresight, he quickly discovered the core of the spell. This time he used his reverse five phases of Yin and Yang's secrets, with the five phases restraining each other, and began to sap away the spell's magic power from the core. The reverse five phases of yin and yang secrets, the five yin phases, and the five yang phases, were like two huge millstones, whose spirit power was grinding away the magical power of the spell little by little. Even though Yang Chen only had the strength of the first Kai Lair, but with some casual effort, he could easily sap away the magic power of the spell formation. After the magic power was lost, the spell also lost its effect and the scene before his eyes changed once again, now resembling the familiar mountain road. As the servant who was leading the way appeared together with Shen Da, Gu Qin, Ho Lin and Ting Yuan, all of them were standing at the same place with a blank expression and in an alert posture, ready to fight. Everyone suddenly saw Yang Chen's silhouette and that corpse without its head and all five of them immediately had a fright. Shen Da and the three others sucked in a deep breath while the servant who was leading the way looked at Yang Chen as if he was looking at a monster. The circumstances before their eyes explained everything, with a glance they could discern that someone had been sent to kill Yang Chen and them, but that killer had already died under Yang Chen's hands, and at the same time he had also gotten rid of the illusionary spell. The assassin's Kiankin pouch was still around his waist. Yang Chen gazed at the five people and leisurely untied it and opened it to check its contents. After taking a few jade slips and several spirit stones, he threw the pouch to the servant who was standing closest to him, Holin. Ho Lin was amazed by receiving the Kiankin pouch and still hadn't clearly understood what was going on. But Yang Chen already held those several jade slips and used his spiritual awareness to examine them. After checking them out, he handed them over to Ho Lin. This is the method and the knowledge about the illusionary spell that guy used, it will help you a little, take it. Inside the Kiankin pouch, there is also some information about a few well-known spells, you can take care of it. As for the rest, you four can divide it among yourselves. That servant who was leading the way was once again stunned and was filled with an incomparable envy when looking at Yang Chen smilingly throw the Kiankin pouch of a six Kai layer master to his own servants as if there was nothing inside of it. His heart was filled with incomparably huge waves of jealousy. As for the assassin's identity, the servant indistinctly recognized him from a mark on his dead body, he was a rogue cultivator from the vicinity of the Miking Mountain, he also had some previous dealings with the people from the Pyuryang Palace. He had the strength of a cultivator at the Six Kai Lair, this was something that even the servant was aware of, even that he had obtained a top-notch talisman tool a few years ago, which he did not reveal to others easily. Thinking about this, he noticed that the talisman tool should still be in the Kiankin pouch which Yang Chen had given away without even batting an eye. The belongings of a Six Kai Lair expert divided among servants. This generosity made the servant even more regretful. Just when he was envying them, Yang Chen walked to him and handed him some of the spirit stones he had taken out from the Kiankin pouch. This is a minor tribute for your hard work. The servant hastily took it in fear and trepidation, then he suddenly felt baffled. How could he have this kind of a sensation when facing a first Kai Layer outer disciple, as if there was an absolute respect for Yang Chen in his heart? Could it be because he killed that six Kai Layer assassin? Or because he treated his servant so generously? This time they stopped for over three hours due to the delay, and the color of the sky had already turned bright and clear. Everyone hastily took care of the assassin's body, and after resting for some time, they quickly continued their journey again. On top of Nine Earth Manor's gate, Sun Hai Jing was gazing in the direction of the mountain, at the road that connected the Yishu Manor to here. Roughly calculating the time when Yang Chen had set off from the Yishu Manor, he should be arriving here now, but there was not a single person to be seen on the road. 
After two more hours passed and there was still no sound of activity on the road, Sun Haijing could not help but rejoice in his heart. This much time had passed already and Yang Chen had still not arrived, surely he had already been taken care of. Ten spirit stones had to be paid for that annoying person's life, but this transaction was really worth it. Even though he was happy in his heart, an anxious appearance was on Sun Haijing's face. He was still incessantly mumbling to himself. How has he still not come? How has he still not come? Occasionally when someone passed and heard his muttering, they truly believed that he was worried about the new younger disciple and was getting impatient. After a long time had passed, Sun Haijing was exceedingly delighted in his heart, many people had already seen his deeply worried and sick at heart expression for his younger disciple, this was already sufficient. Just when he thought that it was enough and he stood up to go down, at the edge of the mountain road, suddenly a figure appeared. That was precisely the person whom he couldn't forget even if he died and his bones turned to dust, Yang Chen. If you are enjoying the content let a like, comment and subscribe to Fantasy World for more. Chapter 27 It's possible now. That instant he laid his eyes on Yang Chen's silhouette, Sun Hai Jing's complexion turned bitter, as if someone had trampled on his face. The news of the appearance of a rogue cultivator attacking the party of an outer disciple on the road connecting the Yishu Manor and Nine Earth Manor would spread quickly. The party also included one servant from the Nine Earth Manor and four servants from the Yishu Manor. It was certain that this news would definitely make the Pyongyang Palace angry and all of the rogue cultivators in the thousand-mile circumference of the Miking Mountain would be thoroughly investigated. Although he had been very careful when contacting the Six Kai Lea Road Cultivator, under this sort of thorough investigation, he and Chu Heng would definitely be suspected. At that time, if they would be exposed, Chu Heng would definitely push all of the blame on Sun Hai Jing. Once he thought of this point, Sun Hai Jing felt as if he had fallen into his own trap. Who could have thought that a Six Kai Lea Road Cultivator could be incapable of overpowering a First Kai Lea Cultivator? Even if there were five third Kai Layer servants on the opposite side, they were still not qualified to become an adversary to a six Kai Layer master. A difference of five stages, that was a disparity in power like a single Jin to 3500 Jin, simply a difference between heaven and earth. The travel from the edge of the mountain to the entrance of the Nine Earth Manor would still take some time. Just like an arrow had been shot after a rabbit, Sun Hai Jing crazily ran towards the Nine Earth Manor to inform Chu Heng about this news. Keep calm, don't create an upheaval. Du Hang glared at the panicking Sun Hai Jing and coldly snorted. That assassin is already dead, so there is no proof of anything, what are you afraid of? Only after Chu Hang raised this point, Sun Hai Jing was finally able to calm down. After Yang Chen reached the Nine Earth Manor, he also didn't reveal anything about it right away. Only, when he looked at Sun Hai Jing, his gaze was full of resentment, but nobody was able to understand this behavior of his. What happened after that was even more unimaginable, against this sudden provocation, Sun Hai Jing, who was at the peak of the third Kai layer, did nothing and just quickly entered closed door training to break through to the fourth Kai layer. Moreover, according to Chu Heng's estimation, this time it was very likely that he would break through. Which person dared to touch a disciple of the Pure Yang Palace at the Miking Mountain? After receiving the news of an attack on Yang Chen's party, all of the higher-ups of the Pure Yang Palace were furious. Although the Yuning ancestors hadn't moved, several Jindan stage experts already began to roar. If a disciple of any sect was attacked by an outsider within the sect's own territory, it was a slap on the sect's face. From top to bottom, everyone was furious. The law enforcement hall went all out and under the lead of a Jindan stage teacher, began to investigate everyone within a circumference of a thousand miles of the Miking Mountain. All of the rogue cultivators within the area were acting as if they were mourning their deceased mothers, all day, they had anxious and painful expressions on their faces under the fury of Pyongyang Palace. That assassin had used an illusionary spell. Liu Qian, who was well acquainted with Yang Chen, brought Yang Chen to the law enforcement hall to speak with him and get first-hand information, before setting out to capture that person. At the moment, Yang Chen was sitting in front of Du Qian, while his four servants, together with the servant who led the way, were standing on the side. The Kiankin pouch was placed in front of Du Qian, and he was browsing through its contents 1v1. This Kiankin pouch contained all of the assassin's belongings. Aside from many crystal stones, these items also included all of the jade slips taken away by Yang Chen, as well as all of the materials divided between Shen Da and the other servants. Since Du Qian was investigating this matter, he had asked for all of these things to look for any clues about the assassin. On one side of Du Qian, the merit-transferring disciple, Chu Heng, was sitting. This investigation was Du Qian's responsibility, he was merely visiting that was all and had no say in it. All of the time he was looking at Yang Chen with an indescribable expression. Using a illusionary spell and a talisman tool, even if it was an 8 Kai layer expert facing this, he would still get confused. My junior brother, how did you escape? 
for the Pure Yang Palace to find the identity of a rogue cultivator on the mountain under its control was really easy. At this moment, Du Qian had already become aware of that person's identity. At the same time, from the things he left behind, he had also discovered how fearsome his cultivation was, but this caused Du Qian to be unable to comprehend the exact situation. The four third Kai layer servants and a fourth Kai layer servant were all affected, but this Yang Chen, who had the lowest cultivation of them all, only the first Kai layer, was surprisingly not influenced in the least bit. I am an executioner, so murderous spirit overflows from my body. It is very rarely that there is something capable of shaking my mind. Yang Chen smiled. He casually continued. If not for this killing intent, maybe I wouldn't have been able to escape it. Yang Chen was speaking casually, but Shen Da and the others did not dare to show this kind of attitude. Shen Da, who had the highest cultivation among them was the first one to speak. Recalling his memories, he said. Indeed, an aura of death had filled the sky, but we had not thought that this was from the young master. The other servants also confirmed what Yang Chen had said. Since Yang Chen was not influenced by the illusions, then getting rid of a person at the Six Kai Lair was also not an impossible matter. Moreover, the assassin's corpse had been found, his head was cleanly cut off by a blade, clearly an executioner's way of doing things. My junior brother, surprisingly you still have this kind of skill. Pretty good. Liu Qian's eyes shone brightly. Not receiving any effect in the area of illusions because of strong killing intent, the more he thought about it, the more his eyes shone. He could not have thought of any such method. Humph, this kind of blasphemy, only after killing many people could this kind of killing intent can be condensed, are you not worried that the heavens will not tolerate this? If Chu Hang was only biased towards Yang Chen before, now he completely had the intention of killing him. Rather than praising Yang Chen, Chu Hang rhetorically said. I am a disciple of the pure Yang Palace, not a killer like you. Hello disciple Chu. Liu Qian's complexion immediately sank, he calmly stated. According to your words my law enforcement hall's disciples are all evil spirits, is this what you think? This opinion, is it just yours or of the entire Luminous Moon Hall? Even if Xu Heng had gigantic guts, he would still not dare to speak malicious words against the law enforcement hall of his own sect. Just a moment ago he had spoken harsh words to suppress Yang Chen, but unexpectedly, they could also be directed towards Du Qian. Senior Disciple Du. Ju Hang turned pale with fright, when the law enforcement hall's people would learn about these words of his, it could be reckoned that his life would not even have a proper ending, so he hastily explained himself. I was speaking to Yang Chen, he still hadn't cultivated but killed so many people, his body is filled with an aura of death, I was just afraid that it would affect his cultivation. I did not mean to insinuate the law enforcement hall. As long as he does not take the initiative to kill, why does it matter if he killed many? Liu Qian coldly snorted again, implying that he would longer look into it, but also warning Chu Heng not to say anything excessive. The body filled with the aura of death is not affected by illusions. Liu Qian again repeated, when suddenly a crazy idea was born within his mind. If he, an outer disciple at the first Kai Lair, was allowed to climb the heavenly stairs, would it make the other sex go crazy? Once this thought appeared in his mind, Du Qian did not suppress it anymore. He had even already imagined the astonished and stunned expression of the great master, Su Bei. Feeling pleased with himself, he burst out laughing. Du Hang wrinkled his brows when seeing Du Qian laugh so freely in front of him, he wanted to stop him, but in the end he decided against it. Although their status was about the same, right now Du Qian was investigating the matter of the attack on Yang Chen, if he forced Du Qian to turn towards him, that would not be a good thing. Younger disciple Chu, since Yang Chen is already an official outer disciple, you should stop caring about the previous matters. Yu Qian kept on freely speaking. Since little brother Yang will cultivate at the Nine Earth Manor in the future, he will need your guidance even more. Yu Qian's request was indeed very excessive, Chu Heng was the merit transferring disciple, while Yang Chen was an outer disciple, so because he had the responsibility of teaching Yang Chen, even if he could not stand Yang Chen, he could only nod his head in defeat. After he sent off Du Qian, Chu Hang's complexion immediately changed. Facing Yang Chen, he coldly snorted. Yang Chen, about the earlier arrangements, since you have already beaten a third Kai Layer disciple, you will still be treated as a third Kai Layer disciple. But, you must not go around the Nine Earth Manor, seeking people to test them. If you have something you can't understand, just come to me. Saying this, Chu Hang's body slightly leaned towards Yang Chen, without paying any attention to the servant standing behind Yang Chen, he impudently said. Only I can provide you with the proper guidance so that you can pass on, do you understand that? After he finished speaking, regardless of Yang Chen's attitude, he burst out laughing and directly walked out, minding his own matters, and his figure disappeared in a flash, without leaving any trace. Naturally, Shan Da and the other three also heard Chu Heng's last words, so they felt very anxious for Yang Chen. 
If Yang Chen could not receive guidance from the merit transferring disciple, this would mean that all of the problems he had regarding cultivation could not be resolved, and at the very least his cultivation speed would be very slow. Yang Chen smiled at Chu Heng's words, he really wanted to slap that pompous expression on his face. He had been a great principal golden immortal, why would he need advice from a foundation stage disciple? Although all this time, he had to endure these kinds of things, seeing Chu Heng's comical performance, he couldn't help but shake his head sighing. This sigh reached the ears of the servants, but they all thought it was because he would not be able to receive any teachings from Chu Heng. However, they still had great confidence in Yang Chen, since he could guide both Shang Yuan Feng and Wang Yuan, so maybe reaching the foundation stage was not absolutely impossible, but it would require some more time, that's all. Moreover, he could also get those profound Yang fruits, so apparently the problem was not a problem at all. No matter how, but Yang Chen had finally entered the Nine Earth Manor and also entered the ranks of Pure Yang Palace's outer disciples. Once more, the distance between him and his master had shortened. Once he reached the foundation stage, he could pay his respects to his master. The hidden pavilion of the Nine Earth Manor was the place where all of the cultivation methods for the foundation stage or lower, and the recipes and tools to concoct various sorts of pills, were stored. Even the experiences gained by many experts of the older generations were stored here. As long as one was from the Pure Yang Palace, it didn't matter whether he was an outer disciple or a servant, all could access the hidden pavilion. However, not everyone could enter the hidden pavilion when they wanted or stay in it for how long they wanted. It would be based on the number of sect contribution points. Based on the number of contribution points one has, one would be treated in the sect accordingly. Not only the time to stay in the hidden pavilion, but also the time to seek guidance from the merit transferring disciple similarly demanded contribution points. Certainly, each month the official disciples would be given their monthly allowances in the form of crystal stones. But servants don't receive this kind of salary, only a few crystal stones. However, to gain contribution points, everyone would have to take a chore from the sect, and only after completing it, would they receive them. The sect needed many things to develop, refining pills also required many types of materials, all of these things, including crystal stones, could be exchanged for contribution points. If the contribution points were not enough, then, to earn them, one could ask for many types of hard labor in the sect, like taking care of the field where all the herbs were grown, lending help in concocting pills or purifying various types of materials and so on. Since Yang Chen was just a newcomer, he naturally had zero contribution points. But this was not a great problem for him. As he had joined the Nine Earth Manor, it signified that he could walk freely anywhere in the territory of the Pure Yang Palace and not have any restrictions, like he had in the Yishu Manor. The surroundings also had one or two cities. Anything, as long as it was not an unusual or uncommon item, needed at the foundation stage or lower, could be exchanged in the cities. Yang Chen had received crystal stones weighing one jin in the Yishu Manor, which can be exchanged for 10 contribution points, enough to obtain the qualifications to remain in the hidden pavilion for one hour. Inside of the hidden pavilion, everything was written in jade slips and not books, like in the Yishu Manor. Regardless whether it was a servant or an outer disciple, all were cultivators and had spiritual awareness, which they could use to read those jade slips. Not only was using the jade slips more convenient, but they could also store a larger amount of information, at least two or three times more than books. After entering the hidden pavilion, Yang Chen spread his spiritual awareness and began to look for the things he needed. This time, he was seeking the basics of ALCHEMY jade slip. This jade slip contained information about the most basic concepts of concocting pills and two elementary recipes. Yang Chen was precisely looking for that. After obtaining this jade slip, Yang Chen could openly learn to concoct pills and afterwards refine the most basic pills. Then he would be able to exchange them for sex contribution points. If Yang Chen had a large number of contribution points, they could be exchanged for all kinds of cultivation methods and it was logical that they would help to increase his own cultivation. Yang Chen could not help but be cautious, every sect regarded their inherited cultivation methods very highly. Before meeting his master, if Yang Chen would be considered as a spy or a person having malicious thoughts, who had to be taken care of, then he would have to walk away from the normal cultivation path. For his master, he would have to endure everything. After looking around for half an hour, Yang Chen finally found what he was looking for. Soon afterwards, inside of the hidden pavilion, Yang Chen loudly screamed in excitement, which even alarmed the supervisor of the hidden pavilion, who was an inner disciple. He was harshly rebuked and then driven out of the hidden pavilion. But, everyone became aware that Yang Chen had taken the basics of ALCHEMY Jade Slip. All of this was a part of his plan, and once he returned to his room, he started happily laughing. From now on he could do everything openly and did not need to hide for the fear of exposing his abilities. 
Even if Yang Chen overstepped his bounds, in the eyes of the sect, he would only be regarded as a genius with abundant cultivation potential. Everyone in the faction which he would choose should be overjoyed. If you are enjoying the content let a like, comment and subscribe to Fantasy World for more. Chapter 28 Useless Pill A recently promoted outer disciple in the Nine Earth Manor, a person with the cultivation of First Kyle Air, had surprisingly started a furnace to concoct pills. This news spread like wildfire in the Nine Earth Manor. Yang Chen's great name very quickly became the talk of the whole Nine Earth Manor. Only when mentioning him, everyone showed two kinds of expressions. When they heard that as soon as he entered the sect he defeated Sun Hai Jing who was at the third Kai Lair, everyone displayed an utterly astonished expression, but when they heard that Yang Chen had entered the hidden pavilion to learn the basics of ALCHEMY and has started a furnace to concoct pills at first Kai Lair, their astonishment immediately changed to sneer. If he can learn how to concoct pills at the first Kai Lair, then what does that make us who have been trying to concoct pills for more than 10 years? Whether it was an official disciple or servant all agreed with this opinion, some had already started clamoring. Everyone cannot help but laugh at this affair. There have been many famous alchemists who had to immerse in alchemy for several decades or even for more long before concocting their first pill. How can there be such a person who can concoct pills as soon as he started cultivating, isn't he just overstepping his boundaries? Not to speak of concocting pills, at first Kai Lair, even if he can control the flame properly and do not burn the ordinary drug ingredients, that alone will be an extraordinary feat. However, Yang Chen doesn't care about these kinds of words. He instructed Shen Da to run to the nearest city to buy an ordinary pill concocting furnace and other common ingredients. Although this was his first time concocting pills, but Yang Chen had already spent all the spirit stones he received at the Yishu Manor. Buying a huge pile of drug ingredients and a beaten out pill furnace, Yang Chen entered seclusion to start on the road of alchemy. In the entire Nine Earth Manor, apart from Shen Da, Ho Lin and his other servants, no one was optimistic about Yang Chen's success. But Shen Da and other three servants had already seen Yang Chen easily remove the impurities of Yang Kai pill with a single hand, so they had entirely confident that Yang Chen will succeed. However, in the entire Nine Earth Manor including all his servants, everyone was curious about what Yang Chen will refine. Regardless of whether he will succeed or not, all the raw material used by Yang Chen surprisingly ordinary herbs purchased from the mortal world. At most, in that year, they would have reached their peak, but it will still be far from enough to assist in increasing the spirit power. Using these ordinary drug ingredients, what kind of pill can he refine? Then even if he succeeds that worn out furnace will easily lose 99% of the drug's efficiency, almost all the people in the Yishu Manor thought this way. Naturally Chu Heng had also heard this news, but he didn't say anything in front of other people, only sneered in his heart and slyly used a disciple who was close to him to spread this news everywhere, even among the inner disciples. As a result, the news that an outer disciple without any foundation was vainly attempting to reach the heaven in a single bound reached the ears of many disciples. Every disciple who heard this absolutely despised him. Irritation was born in their hearts towards Yang Chen. Within his small courtyard, Yang Chen opened a room which he regarded as the pill room. With the help of Ho Lin who had basic knowledge of alchemy, he started pill concoction for the first time after his rebirth. Yang Chen had chosen to produce a traditional medicine, however, people were not aware of this kind of pill. After 300 years from now, this pill will be produced and known as Shun Kai pill. All ingredients used to make this pill are ordinary, and after being produced this elixir will not increase the spirit power, nor will it heal anyone. As for those disciples who had already reached the first Kai Lair, it will be of no use. But for the preparatory disciple who had just started cultivation, it is an extremely useful elixir. Shun Kai pill, as the name implies can precisely sense the immortal Kai. After consuming this sort of elixir, the ability of ordinary people to sense Kai will increase by two to three times, and they will be easily able to feel the Kai in nature. Naturally for this kind of pill, Yang Chen won't waste the precious materials acquired from the medicine garden. All drugs who have matured thousand years or more, even if they are ordinary drugs, possess an unusual medicinal efficacy. Using the ordinary ingredients purchased from the cities is already sufficient. Yang Chen didn't tell all this to Ho Lin and just instructed her to pay attention controlling the flame. Ho Lin had already done all the preparations needed for the process, now a pile of proper drug ingredients was stored near her waiting for Yang Chen's instructions. After everything is done and ready, Yang Chen sat upright on a mat on the ground. His both hands stroking the two handles of the pill furnace in front of him and started the fire. Previously Yang Chen had chosen the fourth fire cultivation method from the achievement room in the Yishu Manor, so naturally the fourth fire was produced in his hands. Two white strands of flame appeared in Yang Chen's both hands respectively, finally converging in the pill furnace. The two strands of flame were successfully pulled to form two spiral-shaped slender threads. 
both threads spiraled around from the edge of the furnace to the core. Yang Chen still hadn't started the refining, but his control over the flame made Ho Lin, who was sitting opposite and watching attentively, gasp in admiration. In a brief period of several days, Yang Chen's control over fire has again risen one step becoming even more proficient. The slender threads of flame were extremely thin because of being pulled giving the feeling that the flame did not have sufficient temperature and can only be seen inside the pill furnace as a fine spiral. Who can realize that they were made up of fire? Safflower? Yang Chen suddenly said. Ho Lin did not dare to be careless and hastily threw the proper amount of safflower into the furnace. Shen Dan. After safflower was thrown into the furnace, Yang Chen again said. Ho Lin who had been repeatedly warned earlier did not get baffled and lightly added the Shen Dan into the furnace. Both the herbs were engulfed by the spiral fire as soon as they entered and started to flow along with the flame. Rotating in two circles under Ho Lin's attentive gaze, they slowly turned into a medicinal liquid. These two ingredients were very ordinary if proper care is not taken they will immediately burn, but at this moment, both of them had turned into a liquid without even a single mark of getting burned. Ho Lin was astonished within her heart, but controlling her emotions, she grabbed the next ingredient and was steadily gazing inside the pill furnace, waiting for Yang Chen's next instructions. After blindly adding in the medicines, Ho Lin discovered a peculiarity. It seemed as if Yang Chen was intentionally controlling the flame to melt these drugs and follow along flame and rotate, apparently this had some other reason. However Ho Lin very clearly understood that even if she had the recipe and exact amount of materials, she didn't have this kind of control and also couldn't produce this kind of pill. One hour quickly passed. During this time, the temperature of the pill furnace was controlled at some fixed point. This was the crucial temperature for refining the Shunkai pill, if it is not exact, then only a waste product will be produced without the slightest amount of medicinal effects. Finally, the moment to collect the Shunkai pill arrived. Yang Chen's approach to collect the pill was very special, at least Ho Lin is unable to make sense of what she is looking at. Not only Ho Lin, if it was any other great alchemist in the world, he will also be unable to recognize this pill collecting skill. Yang Chen had learned this pill collecting skill from the pill scripture given by the great supreme elder. The great supreme elder had a very high level knowledge in concocting pills second to none, also, the pills refined from the pill furnace of the great supreme elder were matchless compared to others. This was not only due to the quality of the furnace, but also because of this unique pill collecting skill developed by him. This pill collecting skill is one of the many other pill collecting skills which Yang Chen found suitable for himself after much thinking. Yang Chen had only once refined this kind of elixir in his previous life to inspect his own fire arts. In any case, he also gained slight understanding about alchemy. Yang Chen can roughly determine what sort of technique should be used to extract a pill. Along with Yang Chen's signal, the medicinal liquid flowing within the pill furnace suddenly started to split into numerous pieces. Every small piece started rotating around and later slowly became circular and solidified. In less than half an hour, all of them turned into a round and plump pills. Seemingly as if an unseen imaginary hand was holding these pills, they started to float within the pill furnace. Soon after Yang Chen stopped the flame in his hands. All these pills fell down and formed a pile at the bottom of the pill furnace. Yang Chen smilingly pulled out a jade bottle prepared long ago to collect these Shunkai pills. Later both he and Ho Lin took out one pill to examine it. Properly refined round and plump Shunkai pills, well proportioned and smooth outer surface, similar from all sides, anyone looking at it will love to twist it between their fingers. Unfortunately, like some good pills, it doesn't have any medicinal fragrance, nor any kind of bad smell like some low-level pills, actually, this elixir doesn't have any kind of odor, which will really baffle people. If Ho Lin would not have seen Yang Chen refine this pill successfully, she herself would not have believed this is an elixir. Ho Lin failed to realize this, but Yang Chen was indeed very clear about it. It doesn't have a medicinal smell because all of it is confined inside the pill without the slightest amount of leakage. Just from the way it is, this Shunkai pill is perfect and invulnerable. Yang Chen was quite satisfied with himself for refining this kind of pill in the first time. Young master, does this pill have any use? Ho Lin curiously asked. She hadn't heard of this kind of strange recipe and strange technique before. She had only asked after thinking about it for a long time. For you and me it is useless. Yang Chen faintly smiled making Ho Lin absolutely astonished at this answer. Isn't useful for Kai Lair? Since it isn't useful for Yang Chen and herself, Ho Lin immediately thought to this extent. Yang Chen slightly nodded and confirmed Ho Lin's conjecture. Seeing Yang Chen confirm her conjecture, Ho Lin's eyes brightly shined could it be that this elixir is useful at foundation stage. Also useless for foundation stage. Yang Chen again replied. Suddenly Ho Lin became suspicious, not useful at Kai Lei or foundation stage, then could it be useful at Jindan stage? How is this possible? 
This pill is refined just by using common herbs. You need not guess anymore, this pill is just useful for an ordinary person, for the benefit of those preparatory disciples. Yang Chen directly answered Ho Lin's question. Hearing this answer, Ho Lin immediately felt somewhat disappointed. He had wasted so many ingredients just for the benefit of preparatory disciples, doesn't this mean he would not gain any profit? Don't be anxious, first let's take this pill to the medicinal hall for appraisal, maybe we will get a nice surprise, how about it? Yang Chen did not specifically tell all the information to Ho Lin, letting her use her own imagination. Medicine Hall is responsible for buying and selling all kind of elixirs and materials in the Pyongyang Palace. It also has a courtyard in the Nine Earth Manor, specifically to serve the outer disciples. Generally buying and selling through Medicine Hall and willing to spend contribution points is considered favorable. As well as if anyone can refine any elixir, Medicine Hall is willing to buy it or even exchange for contribution points. Your Yang Chen. Medicine Hall's elder sized up Yang Chen and wrinkled his brows. Seeing Yang Chen nod admittingly, even though he did not have any friendly relations with Yang Chen, he patiently tried to advise him, cultivation requires a steady and serious nature, if you want to practice alchemy, you must raise your cultivation and then come again. You should not waste your time doing this otherwise, it will be of no benefit to you. Hearing this advice, Yang Chen was quite pleased, since the other party was considering his own benefit. If others show good intentions towards him, Yang Chen will also not think ill of them. Many thanks senior for your good intentions. Yang Chen cupped his hands to express his thanks. Soon after taking out the jade bottle containing the Shunkai pill, he handed it to the elder and said Senior help me appraise this. How is the quality of this pill? What is this pill? The medicine hall's elder took the jade bottle and opened it. Looking at the pill he asked the appearance is actually pretty good, but it is any useful. When I was at the Yishu Manor, I had eaten a few herbs which have been useful to increase my sensation for Kai. So I tried to refine something, but don't know whether I succeeded or failed. Also thanks for your trouble the elder of the medicine hall to identify it. Yang Chen randomly fabricated some excuse to conceal the affair regarding the recipe. DL note. So that no one becomes suspicious of him. I will accept the medicine, you should return back and wait for news. Appraisal of elixirs requires, at least, two days. Medicine hall's elder didn't say much, he had already told him what needed to be said. Moreover, even if Yang Chen had truly refined this stuff, it will be no use advised him again to pay attention to his real work and so on. So he only followed Medicine Hall's rule and told Yang Chen to wait. Yang Chen returned back to his courtyard to cultivate and wait, but again a lot of rumors started in the Nine Earth Manor. Yang Chen who didn't know the limits of his own capabilities, had surprisingly refined an elixir from ordinary ingredients and taken it to the Medicine Hall for appraisal. Furthermore, according to an elder of Medicine Hall who had analyzed the elixir for half a day, this stuff has absolutely no use at the Kai Layer or Foundation stage. This news immediately gave rise to a lot of baseless rumors and mockery. Shen Da, Ho Lin and the other servants who ran errands for Yang Chen in the manor also had to face taunting expression with occasional sympathetic looks everywhere they went. Some people also felt sympathy for their next eight generation as they were following this kind of unreasonable master like Yang Chen. This time, everyone was convinced that Yang Chen would turn into a joke when the appraisal of the elixir will come out, so they were all waiting to mock him. That medicine hall elder had ample experience, just by tasting any new medicine, within half a day he can determine its medicinal properties. He had already said that it is ineffective for cultivators at Kai Layer or Foundation stage, so it is surely useless. An elixir made only from ordinary ingredients how can it be effective at Jindan stage? As everyone in the Nine Earth Manor was waiting for Yang Chen to appear at the medicine hall, suddenly appeared a person who had never before visited the Nine Earth Manor, the master of Pure Yang Palace's medicine hall, Jindan stage expert Zhu Chen Tao. Zhu Chen Tao immediately went inside the branch of the medicine hall and hurriedly asked the person in charge where is Yang Chen? Where is that Yang Chen who had refined this Shunkai pill? At once bring me to meet him. If you are enjoying the content let a like, comment and subscribe to Fantasy World for more. Chapter 29 The useless pill turns out to be significant. The master of Medicine Hall was known to have an absolutely unconventional nature in the Pyongyang Palace. His entire life he had meticulously researched alchemy and different medicines, even delaying his own cultivation. If it were not for the support of large quantities of elixirs, it would have been impossible for him to enter the Jidan stage. However, since he was a master alchemist, this kind of advancement was normal for him with the help of alchemy. These days Zhu Chen Tao was researching a difficult problem regarding the concoction of pills when he heard some younger disciples talking about this new type of unusual elixir. Reportedly this new elixir helps neither in cultivation nor has it any other effect after consumption. This made him quite confused. 
when delving into a difficult problem, one should try to look at it from a different angle, maybe he would be able to gain a sudden insight, Zhu Chen Tao also held this kind of opinion. That's why he called that younger disciple to come over and thoroughly inquired about this Shunkai pill. If it has no use for a person who cultivates, then what other significance does it have? Zhu Chen Tao was baffled. However, since this elixir had already been collected for appraisal, Zhu Chen Tao must have a look so that he can determine what use it has. Seeing that the medicine hall master himself had personally appeared, the younger disciples hastily brought the elixir to him and explained everything to him about this elixir, such as the fact that this elixir cannot be used by people who cultivate, and also this elixir was refined by a first Kai layer outer disciple. Just by holding the elixir for a moment, Zhu Chen Tao was able to determine about 90% of the ingredients in the elixir. He can immediately determine some medicines just based on their color alone. 9 out of 10 of the raw materials in this pill were very mediocre herbs, so as to say they were all used by ordinary people. Not even a single high-grade herb was used. Feeling disappointed, Zhu Chen Tao was just about to return this Shunkai pill, when suddenly he discovered a slight anomaly. This pill was very carefully made and refined, it did not emit even a single trace of medicinal smell. Just this skill alone made Zhu Chen Tao feel inferior. He was a Jed and stage alchemist, so to manufacture this kind of pill using ordinary ingredients was not a very difficult matter for him. However, he was aware that the disciple who refined this pill was just at the first Kai layer, which was an absolutely remarkable feat. Thus by looking at the mastery with which the pill was created, Zhu Chen Tao determined that a thorough study on this thing, known as Shun Kai pill, was required. Since this kind of ordinary drug cannot influence him in any way, Zhu Chen Tao grasped a pill with his fingers and ate it. He believed that the fastest method to appraise a pill is indeed to use one's own mouth to taste it. As soon as it entered his mouth, the Shunkai pill quickly melted and disappeared as if it had turned into air. Subsequently, it was no longer there. Zhu Chen Tao was stunned, don't tell me this pill has this kind of effect. This herb is named Shunkai pill, surely it must have a purpose. Zhu Chen Tao thought about it for a moment and apparently thought of something. He again picked up a Shunkai pill and it entered his mouth. However, once again this elixir quickly melted in his mouth, but this time, he was concentrating his soul to sense exactly what is happening and discovered something acutely different. As soon as the elixir melted in his mouth, an extremely feeble stream of Kai attempted to rush into his channels, however it was stopped by his own spirit power and immediately dissipated without a trace. However a shine appeared in Zhu Chen Tao's vision, he was familiar with that recent sensation when the stream of Kai attacked his channels. This was the same sensation he had felt in the days when he had barely begun to cultivate and had attempted to sense the Kai. Yes, no wonder why this was called Shunkai Pill. This elixir is the most simple means to assist those preparatory disciples to find the Kai sensation. Not useful for cultivators. Chu Zhen Tao did not particularly care, he was the medicine hall's hallmaster, so compared to those ordinary disciples, he must be even more broad-minded and should consider the benefits to Puryang Palace even more. No matter how strong a sect is, it is always because of its disciples, directly from the lowest level preparatory disciples to the outer disciples and all along up to the inner, and even to the direct disciples, the disparity grows higher layer after layer. However, the lowest level disciples are the foundation of any sect. The sect's growing potential is not at all determined by the most powerful person within the sect, but it is decided by the lowest level preparatory disciples. Zhu Chen Tao was an experienced person, so he was aware that trying to find the sensation of Kai as a preparatory disciple before they start cultivating is extremely difficult. If at that time, they had the assistance of this Shunkai pill, Zhu Chen Tao was sure that the time required for them to become an outer disciple would at least be cut by half. If the time to reach the first Kai layer can be cut by half for every preparatory disciple, then compared to the present, the number of people who can become outer disciples will increase by many times. A large number of outer disciples implies that the number of inner disciples will also greatly increase, and the higher the number of disciples, the greater the sect's potential. After he realized this point, Zhu Chen Tao took this bottle of Shunkai pills directly to the palace master. As the leader of the sect, the palace master's view on this matter was even more sensitive, and at once his eyes brightly shined. This disciple must be heavily rewarded. The palace master immediately decided to reward Yang Chen. Also, this Shunkai pill is my pure Yang Palace's secret. Apart from us, two people, disciples of the sect and especially your medicine hall's disciples. The secret of this Shunkai pill certainly must not be easily revealed to outsiders. Having this Shunkai pill, I am absolutely certain that within a hundred years my Puryang palace will be able to expand many times. Having said that, even the Yuanying stage sect leader's voice started shaking. However, a tiny first Kai layer outer disciple was still unworthy for the sect master to show himself personally. 
therefore, the medicine hall's hallmaster Zhu Chen Tao volunteered himself to go and find Yang Chen. Even Zhu Chen Tao himself had some selfish interests for undertaking this task. After sampling the Shun Kai pill with his own mouth, he knew what it was made of. Even if he was a great master of concocting pills, if given the same drug ingredients, he still was incapable of properly refining this Shun Kai pill. Strictly speaking, he basically hadn't seen the Shun Kai pill being refined. Even if he had seen the procedure he would only be able to produce a pill quite resembling it, but that also wouldn't have even a little bit of its effect. This made Zhu Chen Tao feel discouraged and simultaneously very excited. The drug ingredients cannot be wrong, so the only mistake can be in the quantities of drug ingredients used and more precisely in the unusualness of the refining technique. It might be possible that he hasn't even heard of this refining technique. Zhu Chen Tao had the urge to immediately meet with Yang Chen and to see the refining technique for himself. Hence, the entire Nine Earth Manor was totally stunned, usually they would only hear the legends of this great character of the Pure Yang Palace, Medicine Hall's hallmaster, Jidan stayed Zhu Chen Tao, who had hurriedly rushed to the Nine Earth Manor and started demanding to meet with Yang Chen. Being graced by the esteemed presence of this great Jidan stage expert, the entire Nine Earth Manor started to jump and fly like dogs and chickens. Who could have thought that a Jidan stage expert would come to the Nine Earth Manor, wanting to meet with an outer disciple who had just recently joined the Nine Earth Manor? Zhu Hang, who was the merit transferring disciple, was also considered as half the owner of Nine Earth Manor, was already very respectfully waiting nearby. Hearing that Zhu Chen Tao was demanding to meet with Yang Chen, although he had a cultivation of foundation stage, he could not help but shudder within his heart. For what reason does a Jidan stage alchemy master so anxiously want to meet with an outer disciple? Even though he was doubtful in his heart, not a single trace of dissatisfaction was seen on Zhu Hang's face. He ordered a disciple to go and find Yang Chen and demand that he immediately come over. Wouldn't it be a joke if a Jidan stage expert would have to lower himself to go to meet with an outer disciple? At that time Yang Chen was cultivating as always, his life these days was utterly serene. To other people it appeared that every day at a fixed time he would meditate and train to circulate his Kai and afterward just idle around within the Nine Earth Manor. Sometimes he would just squander away the sex contribution points earned with great difficulty and exchange them all for time at the hidden pavilion. Every day he would sit around in meditation to train and circulate his Kai in the eyes of countless people, this was already lazy to the extreme. They had never seen a lazier person than him. Adding to Chu Heng's unintentional attitude, other than his four servants, basically no one paid any attention to him. Even Sun Hai Jing, who had recently come out of his closed-door training, also did no longer have that kind of hatred towards him as earlier. On one hand, Sun Hai Jing who had cultivated even a step further, seemed to have let go in his mind. On the other hand, bothering about such a lazy person also didn't seem appropriate with his status. The more laziness Yang Chen displayed, the less threatening he became. But no one was aware that although Yang Chen only cultivated for one day in a week, in reality, in that one circulation, he would cultivate the yin and yang five phases secret forward and backward, and also every time before cultivating, he would consume a profound yang fruit's pulp. The pulp of the thousand-year profound yang fruit contains within its spirit power that could make a stream of saliva flow from people's mouths. Even if this much medicinal power cannot be absorbed completely, in the situation where Yang Chen's yin and Yang five phases secrets are instigating each other, a single circulation is enough for Yang Chen's cultivation to reach the realm of second Kai layer. However Yang Chen was not satisfied with this dramatic increase in the spirit power and used the reverse five phases to subdue each other so that the rapidly increasing spirit powers will crazily try to restrain each other and cancel out, only leaving behind the purest portion which the reverse five phases aren't able to offset. Nevertheless due to these reverse five phases of yin and yang, Yang Chen's cultivation once again returned to first Kai layer. Being processed by these kinds of forward and backward five phases of yin and yang's loop, the spirit power in Yang Chen's body was being continuously purified. Only Yang Chen knew that this kind of purification was the best of the best. When he reaches the pinnacle of Kai layer and tries to break through to the foundation stage, he won't have to purify the heterogeneous spirit power within his body. Countless people bottleneck at the pinnacle of Kai Realm just because they had used a variety of means to increase their magic power rapidly in order to rush to the pinnacle of the Kai Realm, but although the magic power is increased, its quality is far from sufficient. But Yang Chen will not have this kind of problem. Since Yang Chen is now displaying fire attributed spirit power, naturally he would focus more on the quality of the fire attribute spirit power. After thoroughly digesting the medicinal power of pure yang fruit, Yang Chen can always intentionally raise the spirit power of his fire attribute and reflect outside for people to sense the fire kai circulating in his body. Every day, a single complete circulation cultivation was already sufficient for Yang Chen. 
if it were not for this profound yang fruit, then the spirit power which he cultivated naturally during training is so small that it can be easily overlooked. Yang Chen was unwilling to waste his time during such hard labor. To the other people, it seemed as if he was just a lazy person. The blindly and painstakingly cultivate is not the correct path. Chen Da and other servants were very suspicious. Before entering the Nine Earth Manor, Yang Chen was not this kind of careless, why had he changed like this after coming here, he seemed like a different person. For them Yang Chen explained if just painstakingly cultivating can guarantee success, then why does the sect still encourage disciples to travel outside, concoct pills of immortality, refined tools, and even do odd jobs to be exchanged for sex contribution points, and still allows disciples to relax after cultivation. Under Yang Chen's influence, Shen Da, Ho Lin and others only cultivated nine circulations in a day. He had informed them that this was their limit. During the rest of the time, other than serving Yang Chen, they do odd jobs at the Nine Earth Manor to be exchanged for sex contribution points. Yang Chen and his servants had turned into unusual few within the Nine Earth Manor. Since Zhu Chen Tao had demanded to look for Yang Chen, naturally a disciple was sent at once to request Yang Chen to come over. It just so happens that at this moment Yang Chen was just taking a stroll, so when he heard someone calling him, he hurriedly rushed to come over. Some distance away, Yang Chen sensed an unusual breath, barely exposing a loftiness similar to a monarch under the heavens. Discovering this grandeur, Yang Chen's emotions were stirred, but his face didn't show any abnormality, and he rapidly followed after the disciple, who was leading the way and arrived at the medicine hall. Zhu Chen Tao didn't meticulously curb his own breath entirely, so naturally it was emitted. Nevertheless, a Jidan stage expert's grandeur made the urge to bow down in worship appear in the nearby people. The waiting disciples were all breathing heavily, but still did not dare to rise, looking at Zhu Chen Tao, their hearts filled with great admiration. Yang Chen still hasn't come to pay his respects to the elders. At a faraway distance, Chu Heng's berating voice was heard. Yang Chen also didn't dare to be careless and very respectfully bowed in front of Zhu Chen Tao. Before he could open his mouth Zhu Chen Tao's figure arrived before him in a flash and clutched Yang Chen. Zhu Chen Tao loudly asked. You are Yang Chen. This Shen Kai pill was refined by you? Yes elder. From his previous life, Yang Chen was well aware that Zhu Chen Tao was a pill concocting enthusiast. He had refined this Shen Kai pill precisely to raise his importance in the medicine hall. Initially, he had planned to refine some high-grade elixir so that Zhu Chen Tao would take notice of him, but he didn't anticipate that Zhu Chen Tao would come this fast. Refine it in front of me. Without saying anything further, Zhu Chen Tao directly instructed Yang Chen to start concocting pills. When everyone standing on the side heard this, each and every person was stupefied. A Jidan stage expert had shown this much impatience just for this, this really made people unable to believe it. Here. Yang Chen was startled, following which he started laughing. Elder, this place has many people present, which is not suitable for the meditation to concoct pills of immortality. We should change the location. While speaking, he glanced at Chu Heng from the corners of his eyes. Very clearly, many people present precisely meant Chu Heng. If you are enjoying the content let a like, comment and subscribe to Fantasy World for more. Chapter 30 Shocking a Jidan Expert. Move, let's go to your concocting room. Without raising any objections, Zhu Chen Tao directly stood up to leave. But this one move, other people who had still not dared to stand up, all hastily stood up. The elder in charge of Nine Earth Manor hurriedly stepped forward and hastily said. Elder, since you want to concoct pills, isn't the medicine hall comparatively suitable? Moreover, all others wanted to observe and emulate younger disciple Yang's pill concocting skill. He did not think this reason was enough, but due to this statement Zhu Chen Tao immediately remembered the palace master's instructions that the sect regards this Shun Kai pill as utterly important and no person should be made aware of it. Hearing the words of Medicine Hall's elder, he straightforwardly gestured with his hands. Do you have the herbs required by Yang Chen? Or do you have his pill furnace which he can use without much trouble? These few words declared his views, naturally everyone who heard this understood that Zhu Chen Tao absolutely did not want to look at Yang Chen's pill concocting in here. Each and every person can only resentfully follow after Zhu Chen Tao, planning to pass by and take a look at what kind of amazing pill Yang Chen had concocted. Seeing what was happening, Zhu Chen Tao wrinkled his brow slightly. What are you all doing? Don't you have any daily activities to attend to? Go do your own tasks. Those who don't have anything to do, immediately go cultivate, don't be lazy. Hearing these reprimanding words, even a fool could understand that Zhu Chen Tao doesn't wish for anyone to follow him. At this moment, looking at Yang Chen's gaze, everyone was extremely jealous of him. This was a Jidan stage expert of Medicine Hall, if this experienced guy were happy and had randomly said a few words of guidance to them, it would have benefited them for their entire lives. Ah. 
what a pity, they received no such opportunity. Upon seeing this, in his heart Chu Heng was also unsure what to think, he hurriedly waved his hand towards everyone and loudly instructed. That busy all of you. Elder, permit this disciple to accompany you. What are you going to assist me with? Since you don't have the fire attribute, you will also not be able to learn concoction, what do you hope to gain by following me? Zhu Zhen Tao did not care whether Chu Heng was an inner disciple or not, whether he was the merit transferring disciple or not, and directly refuted him harshly. You sure are one easygoing merit transferring disciple, don't you have any matters you have to attend to every day, eh? Facing this rebuke from Chu Zhen Tao, Chu Heng did not dare to utter half a letter and hastily bowed, asking to be excused. However when his gaze swept across Yang Chen, it was filled with malicious blaming. Zhu Chen Tao just happened to catch this glance of his and immediately said with utter dissatisfaction. What are you looking at? Why? Are you jealous of an outer disciple just because he can concoct pills? Luminous Moon Hall's disciple, why are you becoming more and more unworthy of my respect? These words were extremely serious, Chu Hang absolutely did not dare to stay at the same place. Everyone watching also didn't dare to casually keep watching and very quickly fled. Even after this, it still seemed as if Zhu Chen Tao was unwilling to forgive Chu Hang and loudly yelled after HIM when cultivating, the most important thing is to cultivate the heart and nurture the character. Their nature still requires some sort of tempering. Many people look forward to the day when they could receive a Jidan stage expert's guidance, but Chu Hang was certainly not happy right now. The recent words of Zhu Chen Tao had been heard by everyone in the Nine Earth Manor very clearly. All of a sudden, he lost a lot of face. After this incident, the eyes of many disciples in the Nine Earth Manor could not help but turn somewhat contemptuous when looking at him. Naturally Chu Heng blamed all of this on Yang Chen once again. However, Yang Chen did not care about Chu Heng's opinion. Since he had already raised his value to Zhu Chen Tao, naturally he was happy to make himself even more significant. He respectfully invited Zhu Chen Tao to his tiny courtyard and immediately commanded Hou Lin to prepare the ingredients. Shen Da, Ting Yuan and Gu Qin were all standing by, waiting for orders, for fear of making Zhu Chen Tao feel dissatisfied. Inside the simple and crude pill concocting room, only these few people were permitted to stay. Other people of the Nine Earth Manor, even if they were enormously curious in their heart, still did not dare to peep in front of a Jidan stage elder. Ho Lin was already shaking due to nervousness, following after her master just for a brief month, and surprisingly he is meeting with a Jidan stage elder. Previously she did not even dare to imagine this kind of thing, but now at this moment, the Jidan stage elder was sitting in front of her. All of this just seemed like a dream. Despite being nervous, Ho Lin's basic skills were pretty good. Soon all of the materials used for the concoction last time were all properly prepared. Even the quantities used were all properly weighed. Soon afterward, Yang Chen took out his pill concocting furnace from his Kiankin pouch and placed it in front of him. This is your pill concocting furnace. Looking at this crude furnace that had already reached its limit, Zhu Chen Tao could not help but reveal an astonished expression. Just with the help of this pill concocting furnace, Yang Chen was able to produce the Shunkai pill. What does this mean? Could it be that another pill concocting genius is going to emerge from the Puryang Palace? This astonished expression on Zhu Chen Tao's face only flashed for a moment before disappearing instantly. He was more interested in knowing Yang Chen's pill concocting skill. He had already seen the ingredients used and compared to his analysis, they were not very different, only there were slight inconsistencies with the amount used, but this was still not sufficient to make Zhu Chen Tao incapable of producing this Shunkai pill. The only thing that can explain this discrepancy is precisely the pill concocting skill used by Yang Chen. In front of a Jidan stage expert, Yang Chen also could not help but take this seriously. Sitting upright in his place, both of his hands started gripping the two handles of the furnace, and he began to work. Before the eyes of everyone present, something suddenly shined brightly, and two flames appeared in Yang Chen's hands. Just with a glance at the flame in Yang Chen's hands, Zhu Chen Tao immediately determined that this is only an ordinary fire of the five elements, and that the flame doesn't have any special characteristics. This was not surprising, it would be a miracle if an outer disciple at first Kai layer had a unique flame. The Shun Kai pill also doesn't have any marks of any eccentric flame, so obviously it is an ordinary flame. Only, Yang Chen's control over the flame made Zhu Chen Tao's eyes open so widely that even his eyeballs seemed to come out. Just as the two thin spirals of flame began to rotate, he immediately fixed his entire attention on the flame within the pill furnace, not even blinking once. Like last time as soon as the drug ingredients were mixed, they melted, then began to rotate, and soon after homogeneously blended with each other. Finally, under Yang Chen's flame control, it was successfully scattered into small, well-proportioned pieces. 
Afterward, Zhu Chen Tao helplessly stared as Yang Chen used a seemingly absolutely ordinary pill collecting skill to take out those successfully refined elixirs and place them in a jade bottle. From beginning to end, Zhu Chen Tao had attentively watched Yang Chen's skill without missing anything. With a rapt attention, he had observed and analyzed Yang Chen's techniques until Yang Chen had finished the refining. After Yang Chen had collected the pills in the jade bottle, Zhu Chen Tao took out a single Shun Kai pill with his fingers and put it in his mouth. Suddenly, a portion of Kai tried to invade his meridians in a flash and disappeared. Yes, this was the genuine Shun Kai pill. Everything taking place right in front of Zhu Chen Tao made him unable to have any suspicion. There were no unique drug ingredients, no mysterious pill furnace, not even a distinct and unique pill collecting skill. All that was different was Yang Chen's fire arts, that kind of skill can even be described as having reached perfection in the eyes of the Jidan stage expert Zhu Chen Tao. You. You. Pointing towards Yang Chen, Zhu Chen Tao spoke the same word twice, seemingly as if he had not thought what he had wanted to ask. This is Zhu Chen Tao's first time facing an outer disciple, but he was still feeling this way. Yang Chen's spirit power was quite inferior, Zhu Chen Tao also didn't expect a first Kai layer disciple to be more powerful. However just talking about his skill in fire arts, the skill he just showed, even Zhu Chen Tao himself, wasn't able to achieve it when he was at the first Kai layer. Although now, relying on his cultivation of Jidan stage, he was barely able to achieve it, but he was still unable to do it as effortlessly as Yang Chen. It is important to know that Yang Chen already had so much control over those two flames that he can lengthen them by pulling them to their limits. The thin flame of fire was so thin that even in the eyes of a great master like Zhu Chen Tao, they were like threads of natural silk. Even if it was Zhu Chen Tao, achieving such a feat was monstrously difficult for him, and furthermore, during the processes required for concocting pills, not even the smallest mistake was allowed. As a master of pill concoction, Zhu Chen Tao clearly understood more than half of the principles behind this Shunkai pill, after observing all the events during the concoction. All there is to it is that those spiral flames sealed inside the pill will instantly appear after consumption, and when the spiral Kai will burst out, people will feel a kind of Kai sensation being imposed externally, which will allow the new cultivators to become aware of the single thread and then rapidly enter into the state of sensing Kai, and that's all there is to it. The important part of this Shun Kai pill are the two spiral threads of flame. They should never intersect and the more they can be pulled, the stronger the medicine's effect. In case the two spirals of flame intersect, the Kai sensation will be destroyed instantly, and even the pill furnace will turn into a pile of scrap. What shocked Zhu Chen Tao was that even if he understood the entire principle behind this Shun Kai pill, if he himself tried to refine the Shun Kai pill this way, he did not dare to guarantee success every single time. However, Yang Chen in front of him, under the pressure of a Jidan stage practitioner, must be even more distracted when controlling the fire to refine the pills. Yet he had finished this serious refining quite easily. This one point even made Zhu Chen Tao feel inferior. After thinking about this, Zhu Chen Tao suddenly felt ashamed of himself. He was a Jidan stage pill concocting master, even he himself could not count how many times more experienced he was than Yang Chen, but in face of such a furnace and those ordinary drug ingredients, even using the worn out furnace when concocting the pills. Unexpectedly even he was inferior to a first Kai layer disciple. How can he endure this? This control over the fire of yours, where did you learn it? Zhu Chen Tao finally steadied his mind and found the focus to ask this question. He wanted to know who had guided Yang Chen so much in the control of his flames that it had turned him into such a freak, which can even make him feel inferior. When I was at the Yishu Manor, manager Shang Yuan Feng guided me once. Yang Chen had already thought of a proper excuse. Facing Zhu Chen Tao's inquiry, he was not even a little bit flustered and frankly spoke. He had said that since I had fire spirit root, in the future when I cultivate, no matter whether it is fighting, refining tools or concocting pills, all are inseparably linked with my control over the fire. He had particularly warned me again and again that I must be able to proficiently control the flame. I obeyed manager Shang Yuan's advice, and after reaching the first Kai layer, I especially practiced controlling my flame for more than half a year. When you cultivate you only circulate once in a day, yet you train to control fire for over half a year. Zhu Chen Tao was startled, he had indeed heard about Yang Chen's experience. This disciple, after entering the Pure Yang Palace within a brief period of one and a half years, had already reached the first Kai layer, the required criteria to become an outer disciple. This kind of speed can already be regarded as equal to a person with extremely good comprehension. Unexpectedly he was actually training his control over fire for half of the year, in other words, he had already reached the first Kai layer within a year. Chen Da and the other servants standing on the side were just as stunned by this, but it also removed the doubt from their hearts. 
In the Yishu Manor when Yang Chen had entered closed-door training, it was always these four servants serving him. During that time they had already sensed some spirit power fluctuations, but at that time he didn't reveal anything, so they had some doubts about this. Now they understood, Yang Chen was not just cultivating once in a day, but rather he was practicing his skills to control fire. Compared to Zhu Chen Tao's shock, within the hearts of Shen Da and the other servants, even more stormy waves began to rise. Although the elders didn't know, they were all aware how difficult Yang Chen's cultivation road was. If the time when Yang Chen was learning letters and other basics was deducted, then from the time when Yang Chen began to cultivate to the time when he reached the first Kai layer, would be the extremely short period of half a year. They were aware that even in the entire Pure Yang Palace, this would be an unprecedented achievement. Just because of Shang Yun Feng's words, you were practicing by yourself to this extent. Seeing Yang Chen nod his head admittingly, only pleasant surprise and shock were left in Zhu Chen Tao's heart. This shock was different compared to Shen Da and the others. He was terrified by this kind of cultivation comprehension of Yang Chen. For a person to achieve success in cultivation, apart from his own innate root, that is the attribute of the spiritual root, what mattered most were other things, like the person's own comprehension and meticulousness, as well as the extent of assistance he received from others. Even if someone has a valuable spirit root but bad comprehension, then he can't even understand let alone cultivate. Yang Chen did not have any kind of external assistance. Just based on a single piece of advice given by Shang Yun Feng, that newly promoted outer disciple, he had practiced his control over fire to this extent. This made Zhu Chen Tao unable to find any words to describe him and could only use the word insane to perfectly describe this kind of ability. Zhu Chen Tao had a sudden impulse. This kind of innately talented disciple, surely the palace master should know about him. This outer disciple who, even facing against the pressure of a Jidan stage expert, could speak frankly and while refining herbs didn't show the slightest amount of confusion. This kind of disciple has shown the highest potential for growth among the disciples recruited by the Pure Yang Palace in the past hundred years. If this kind of disciple is not carefully cultivated, then that would Pure Yang Palace's greatest loss. So, Yang Chen, I won't regard you as an outer disciple, and you also shouldn't regard me as an elder. We will get rid of our status and simply probe your control over the fire. What do you say? The more he observed Yang Chen, the more he became fond of him. Zhu Chen Tao had a sudden urge to take him as a disciple, but he was aware that at present this was not possible. But he could still give him directions. He certainly did not wish for Yang Chen to take the wrong path. Once these words came out of Zhu Chen Tao's mouth, Shen Da, Ting Yuan, Holin, Gu Qin, all four people were dumbstruck. Who was Zhu Chen Tao? For these four people, he was a legendary existence. Even if any outer disciple sees him, he would immediately kowtow to the elder. What is he saying? To get rid of their identities. To investigate together equally. Have they misheard or is the world just going crazy? How can I deign the elder to trouble himself? However apparently as if Yang Chen had not realized Chu Zhen Tao's implied intentions, he modestly replied. Then immediately spoke out. I have somewhat not understood the situation, I request the elder to guide me. If you are enjoying the content let a like, comment and subscribe to Fantasy World for more.